This is an explicit podcast where we try to keep the conversations as raw and authentic as possible with no intentions of hurting anyone. So if you're very woke, religious, or sensitive, we highly recommend you do not tune in. And I was like, where the fuck is this guy? Like, I went, I just like went a whole around the KTM. I went to the toilet looking for him. So and then Harish, I had to what? go to the KTM, uh, what do you call? Platform. Uh-huh. I went down there to search for him. Where the train goes. Yeah. Where the train goes. Okay. <laughs> Not on the actual. I feel on it. Yeah. yeah. And then I was like, you know, fuck it. I'm going to go and TD that myself. <laughs> <laughs> like, I thought I thought like you had like uh, six cents. Oh, Ashraf is here. Ashraf is here. No, <laughs> you dude. Then you turned. You saw him. Are you talking I mean, about how you got lost? Yeah, dude. Yeah. That's why. That's why we ask you to pick up. Pick us up in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Wow, you're holding the mic, ah. Uh. You're hosting, ah, uh, bro. Yeah. I'm Langsi, bro. Hey, fuck you, lah. Hey, fuck you, lah. Open for Douglas Lee, Langsi D. Yeah, yeah. Wow. No, yeah, dude. dude. No, dude. I open for Jason Leong. Fuck the cops. Fuck Ashraf lah. That's so good, dude. <laughs> yeah, Harish, now also, lineup suddenly got two two shows already. Back no, we're show. back to one show. Yeah. Huh? Why? Because uh, life's not worth it, dude. Yeah. <laughs> it's for the passion lah, bro. Oh, it's for the passion lah. Yeah. It's for the scene, dude. Who gives shit about the money? Who gives, yeah, it money, the money. Fuck that shit lah. Uh. Hey, but seriously. Hey, fuck it, you wanna buy your iPhone, right? Hey, let ah. me let me suck the lineup's balls for a bit, lah. Okay, okay so <laughs> yeah, which one left or right? Let me oh, su- I, I I suck both, okay. Both, are. yeah, each side equality, bro. Okay, guys. By the way, turn up to the lineup. October twenty eighth, nine pm, Drum Asia, Hartamas. Yes, can see this flag. This is this Will guy this be is, released by then? This is the mascot of the lineup. <laughs> Good question, right? I didn't bring my shoes, lah. But you didn't bring your shoes, or didn't bring wait, your crutches? Hey, right I didn't bring my leg, bro. <laughs> wait, wait, okay. <laughs> and Hey, hey. hey, okay, so end of this month, the lineup, how many episodes? I mean, sorry, how many shows? Okay, so uh, episode number what, lah, this one? How many uh, shows? No, 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 no I mean, October, go one October. show. We're doing one, one show one now. Show only. So, we're trying to sell out the show first. Yes. Once we sell out the show, and then if we have enough tickets for the next show, then we open it. Okay, show. unlike the last time, this episode will come out before the, 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 the lineup. Oh, okay, hey, nice. So, guys. If you all go to Crack House Comedy Club, R.I.P. Crack House. Yes. Okay, I, I love Crack House. Crack House is a great place. But they, they don't charge 60 bucks for um, comedy night, right? On the weekends. If you go to the lineup here, ooh, you got killer lineup. You got killer comics over there, okay? Hindra Bose. Yeah. And you have Mertified. Why are you saying Hindra Bose? Yeah, this, this man Hindra Bose performing. And Harish is eating nothing but potatoes every day so he can charge 35 bucks for tickets. Yes. So please come. Yeah. 35 yeah. bucks for tickets. And guess who is... Headlining is he? Is he the the final act? No, final act is uh, this. Actually, all of us. All of us. No, okay, no, so it's this. gonna be okay. Hindra. Yeah. Ho- Harish is gonna be the host, and then we're gonna have Jason Leong. Ooh. That's so one guy. No, no one is left out. You know? Everyone so is a star. Everyone, yes, of course. Even the audience, even the people behind the scene, even the, even the audience. Yeah. 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 The, the audience wow. are the main fucking stars. thing. Did yeah. they get to come and tell jokes also? No, 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 not that far. But you can come as a star. Just come there. I'm a star too, and then just fuck off. Don't come on stage. Yeah. So everyone is. A winner. Oh, cool, man. The world is the stage, bro. Harish really wants to iPhone at this point. No, I actually <laughs> meant that, but I know somewhere someone thinks I'm being a fucking asshole. No, no, he actually means it. No, no, no. Okay, like, jokes aside, he actually means it. Like, he does the comedy thing because he really believes, like, people should come and watch comedy for a cheaper price because he's fucking inflated the price and everything. But he also wants iPhones. So please come no, back. No, the thing is, I don't think ah. I want to exist, though. I just want to ha- make comedy happen. I don't want to exist. It's happening with or without you, bro. Yeah, it's happening before. <laughs> It's okay, bro. We understand, bro. We understand. No, but I understand your point. Just part of the ethos. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. What is saying, bro? Ethos. What is ethos? I heard. Bro? I heard the word on YouTube. So. <laughs> ethos means ethos, uh, the new mentos, right? <laughs> it's electrical. <laughs> ethos, <laughs> la. ethos. Yeah, hybrid mentos, lah. La. <laughs> it shocks you. <laughs> Yo, Taj, why are you wearing watch at home, dude? It's not my house, right? <laughs> but still, it's a house. Good. <laughs> So what am I supposed to take out, put it where? And get his hands out. What is What's it? wrong with wearing... Uh, I don't yeah, know. I feel yeah. like you're going to have... Why are you wearing shit inside? Why are you wearing a clothes? Ah, why are you wearing a clothes? <laughs> no, 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 no. You can't play religious or God is not real. Oh, sorry. Religion cannot. Religion cannot. I don't go to jail. <laughs> hey, I'm sure I'm just... I don't go to jail, dude. You go to jail? I don't want to go to jail. You won't go. You <laughs> Muslim. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot. <laughs> I got boomy rights, dude. What? Fuck, I got boomy rights. It really. Hey, boomy yeah. rights really? means earth rights, right? Yes. Boomy rights means yes. earth rights. So everyone is everyone's rights, sir. Technically. Yeah. No, no, no. You're going to jail, huh? Uh, oh, you can't uh, say that. Uh, 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 okay. uh, cut, cut. cut. Okay. Rewind, rewind. Rewind, rewind. This whole thing just cut. Start from now. Hi guys, this is the Let's Get It podcast. Hey. It's his, by the way. Hey, Tash. Um. So yeah, you you were supposed to tell the story like you got into an accident. Do you uh, mind telling? 
I thought the fucking last. Why the fuck was I here the last episode then? I'm joking. Bro. I told you, dude. So Harish will tell how he took the sand track and hit Harish, please. Yeah, Harish. So the sand track was actually uh, from yeah. Clang. It was kind of from Clang. Mm-hmm. And uh, I saw it happening to it. So Ashraf, from well, Clang. The moment he started the car, I know this guy's gonna kill someone tonight. But you know, did you know it was me? No, no, no. Did I knew you back then? Yes, of course. Oh, I knew you pre leg, right? I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, I need some context, man. Pre no, no, this whole thing is bullshit. <laughs> yeah, I know. Okay. No, I mean, I'm gonna say you're asking some... context for bullshit. No, for them. <laughs> oh, no oh. context. This is bullshit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you're asking context for bullshit. Over. Let's get it. Let's get it. No, no. Let's get, get it, guys. Okay, let's start again. Hi, my name is Murthy. This is Ashraf. This is Harish. That's whoever runs the podcast. Got two other fellas there: Shen and Gary. Gary, put the headphone properly. By the way, if you're getting invited <laughs> to uh... yeah, what? Brian's podcast yes. and he offers you coffee it's 3 in 1 coffee right? yeah. yeah and he doesn't believe in sugar so dude there's more sugar in 3 in 1 coffee yeah yeah, yeah. I think that bro, I, I put no, li- li- literally I put double packet for bro, you I can dude. taste my future yeah, yeah. yeah. for me yeah, so like put double packet no no only, only Tash okay, thank you dude yeah, appreciate because that because he specifically what brand uh, Otong oh. yeah you don't do Nescafe yeah? uh, Nescafe. I do Nescafe is stronger it's yeah. sweeter also nice. this is uh, what this tastes this is creamier no, no, old town, old town my old coffee, town, yeah, town, Chinese one. No, no, no. Halal, halal. Bro. Which old town? Halal. Kampung <laughs> Lama, <laughs> So, where is this old town? Uh, should be Ipoh la. Ipoh. <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah. It's not, the, it's not the, it's not the old. old town. I don't so, idea to be honest. So I just have this idea: the old town meaning yeah? a town from the past. Yes. They make in the past and then transport to the future. Is it going to be a new town joker? No, that's no. an old town coffee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think that's what it means. It was made in a, let's say, the 18th no, the, century. No, the town was always old. Yes. Kampung Baru, Kampung Lama. Uh, Kampung Baru no, but hear the idea out. Like, what if a cafe actually makes coffee from the 18th century and then it transfers to the... Yeah. Using what? Hopes and dreams, sir? No, yeah. hurry. Technology, bro. Like, hey, Imagine, I, like, I like to taste a coffee from the 18th century. Uh-huh. Isn't the, wouldn't that be nice? It, I, I personally, as from a business standpoint, yes. it would be cheaper for, to ask a person to make it the way it was made in the 18th century than rather than building a time machine, yeah. a portal. No, if you're going imaginary. Thing, te- the advancement of technology will probably end up to a point where we can do such things. But it would, like, okay, business, well, the world I don't like this conversation. Yeah. I believe in possibilities. <laughs> so you think time travel is uh, incoming or? I, like I said, I, I can't... Time, <laughs> what were you saying? <laughs> time travel is a pyramid text, scheme, dude. <laughs> but I believe in the possibilities of almost anything Speaking happening. of uh, uh, pyramid schemes, so, yeah. korang tau apa tu Ota FX? Ota FX. Oh, Ota FX. Okay, guys, y'all can take this one. <laughs> y'all can take this one. He says up, lah. Huh? Checking out. He says up. What he says up? Matt, sir. No, dude. Yeah. That's the guy who promotes uh, Ota FX. Ota FX. Himalaya. Ah. Mama, dude. Understandable, lah. <laughs> Mama. What? Yeah. My, pe- la. my people. Dude. His people. Wait, wait, wait. So he's 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 the, the CEO. Of pure it? blood, lah. Pure blood, mama. Yes. Yeah, yeah. He Magal, lah. He half blood. La. Magal, Magal is Malay. What, what's his name? Magal. <laughs> they what's don't his? have the Indian blood. Yeah. What's his name, dude? Isa Isa Isab. I S A I S A R B. Isa 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 Isa. He's the one, lah. Hey guys. Same name, but the second one got B. Korang nak tahu tak aku buat pod, uh, what? Not podcast, what? Uh, aku buat uh, Octa FX. Buat trading. Ah, uh, buat trading. Dalam 15 that, minit boleh ah, buat apa? Yes, that's yes. the guy. That's you watch too many of that thing. He look like Indian, right? You got no YouTube premium, ma. Just, ah, I'm ready for trading. I <laughs> should have left, lah. I got a feeling after once this episode as yeah. DBK will sponsor us, dude. Why? To go to jail, lah. <laughs> to go to jail. <laughs> 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 they sponsor the transport, dude. They sponsor transport, lah. Ni, ni, kita, kita ada Rolls Royce. That's not bad, dude. To go to jail? For how long? I'll go to jail if they take me in a Rolls Royce. You really, you, your, your, your aim in life is very short. <laughs> <level>. Off, lah. <laughs> off, very off, lah. <laughs> yeah. Rolls Royce ain't shit. He wants to go to jail. Harish believes in the future or the past, depending. No, he's flying talking cars. about time travel. Flying cars? Sorry? Flying cars? What's flying car? Oh, flying, flying cars. Flying cars already exist, so Harish I believe believed in it. Harish believed in it like, until 2020. 2020. Then, but... Wait, what do you mean he believed in it? He's the one who said what? Uh, Tundok uh, said, um... By 2020, we'll have flying cars or something, right? Uh, I don't yeah, know. Are you sure about that quote? Or? In somewhere, somewhere. In 2020, he said we have. No, flying not. Cars. Yeah, in 2020, what was not was the fact that we'll have flying cars in Malaysia. Why did you even say that? Yeah, Ask yeah. him. No, I know, honestly, when I was in high the school. The bro. That's when, when people say. Wow, like, do, 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 yeah, do, 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 do,
No, because that was the thing. I think he said it or someone said it. I think he said it. I'm pretty because sure when, it. when, I think since, because since we were children in school, yeah. when somebody mentioned Waos and Doplo Doplo, they already like, like let's say there's a Waos and Doplo Doplo. It's mural, like futuristic, mural, flying mural, cars. Flying, ca- flying cars is already like one Indian, Malay, Chinese eating from one plate. Elements, you know. Ah, uh, what? Indian? Huh? Indian, Malay, Chinese eating on one plate. Ah, the one. Very, Mr. Fucking like, Pool. Like, <laughs> Like oh, as if that's the only three races in Malaysia. I'm racist, lah. Shut the fuck up. What what other races there? I Dude, don't know. Like bro. other the Sab- Sabah, 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 the Dan line line. Dan uh, line, yeah. line, the line line is actually bigger. Yeah, line line is actually bigger. Combine lah. Really. We all should be line line, dude. Dude, just now Tash. Oh, that's true. Yeah, it's back. Just now I was talking to Tash, right? Then uh, Tash, I I told Tash like, uh, Malaysian Indian population in Malaysia, uh, Indians make up like. You say ten. I said I said seven or zero point seven. He said zero like zero point seven. I said seven or zero point seven because I read somewhere. Then he said ten. Uh, but how can it be zero point seven? No, I I remember reading seven or zero point. I I forgot which one. So I think it's zero point seven. Yeah, it's probably zero point seven. No way. No, I think. You know it's, what? Yeah. No, 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 no. no. Google is, the rest. No, it com- confirm is almost ten percent. Oh. Okay. If you say if you say Malaysian population of Malaysia by race, let's see. Indian seven point three. There we go. Others zero point seven. Oh yeah, yeah that makes so more sense. So, Wimputra is sixty-seven point four, yeah. Chinese twenty-four point six, yeah. Indian seven point three. There we go, seven point three. The others were zero point seven. So that's the last two that I saw. Uh, okay, <laughs> okay. There's there's actually a counter argument to this, but if I say it, I'm going to jail. What's that? Sorry, again. There's a counter argument to this. Yeah, what's the counter? Uh, the line line is actually more than the Malays. But if you combine everybody, like, but yeah. they're in the jungle. No, 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 no. The but if I told you. I will be. I'll. You go to jail. I'll go to jail. You be Rizal lah. Oh, oh. No, 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 no. I only discovered this when I went to Sa- Sabah. What's your sauce? Trust me, bro. Huh? What's your sauce? Sauce. Trust, trust me, bro. Trust me, bro. You can't put him down like that. What? You can't put him down like that. What? You gotta acknowledge his. I am acknowledging it. What is this trust me, bro? Bullshit. Uh, it's a. It's a joke, huh? So you're asking. Joker. You're asking Joker. context with huh? bullshit, huh? Huh? <laughs> it's a joke, is it? Huh? Slight joke, lah. Thirty percent, kena. I thought you like jokes. What is this? Dude, I I literally I literally got scared, dude. Not is threatening you. When it becomes serious, like joke, huh? Joke, huh? The, only okay. the only person that works is my brother. The only person. The only person that never works is my brother. Oh shit! You oh yeah, yeah. Like, oh, okay, his his brother is working, sir. Yeah, yeah. I, I I remember. This podcast is no longer yours, bro. Yeah, I honestly, you guys speak too fast, man. Okay, okay. Everybody, slow down. Okay, okay. Slow down. Yeah. So yeah. no, bro. Harish, you get. Fuck this shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> so Ashraf, you seeing anyone lately? What you seeing my ex, right? <laughs> Fuck you, lah. I didn't. I didn't say a name. I didn't say a name. She's a Christian girl. I never say a name. Okay? <laughs> you don't have to give the fucking clue. Hey, no, no, no. Tell her SPM call, lah. How is she being a Christian girl a clue, bro? There's like a billion Christians. Huh? She's a oh, Jesus like girl. A religious type, bro. Yes, very religious type. Jesus type. A Jesus type. Dude, dude, like, what is a Jesus like, type? Sure you know what is Jesus, lah? What? It's the epitome of the Christian religion, you know. So she's religious, lah. How can you be? So I'm Morgan type. Yeah. What is Morgan? Mur- no, he said he said she's not religious. She's Jesus type. Is that a, a Indian type. god? Or? That's a blood type. <laughs> <laughs> blood type Jesus. That's a blood type. What? Is that an Indian god? <laughs> yeah, Mur- Yo, keep that, dude. Yeah, it's a blood type. Yeah. Keep that. <laughs> What's your blood type? Jesus. Jesus positive. Jesus positive. Uh. <laughs> Jesus positive. <laughs> Guys, jokes, jokes. Jesus please, is please, always please. positive, right? Yeah, Jesus is always positive, bro. That's why the cross lah, positive. But anyways, <laughs> sorry. <That's> <laughs> anyways, we're getting uh, cancelled, bro. Yeah, we're getting cancelled. We go to jail first, then get cancelled. If you go to jail, then after three days, we'll come up by ourselves on a cross, sir. <laughs> Stop it. Hey, you know what? Fuck what? it, lah. I don't mind dying on a cross, lah. Fair Fuck enough. you. Who is saying fuck you, dude? Yeah, why, why are you so bad to the yeah. audience? Dude? Yeah, dude. It's all male, lord. So he's like, I want to be the better. Sorry, guys. Uh, but that's what you do at the no, lineup. <laughs> to my haters, I think. Harish, let me ask you something. Do you actually have haters, sir? Yeah. It's no. all the boys inside me, dude. Who hates him? Yeah, he's, he's like such a nice guy. Inside him. It's all are there haters him. like on on the lineup? Like people who comment like hate shit and all? Uh, some of the videos. Uh, bro, you know the... Ashraf one? The last po- podcast we post about the... We talked about the 1969 May 13 shit, right? Uh-huh. There's some people like... Threaten with parang or what? Yeah, yeah. Like say one uh, basically threaten you. They just uh commenting lah. It was like talking shit. Jangan the, the berulang balik all the stuff all is it? Basically saying like oh I can't wait for May thirteen to happen again you know so yeah, I can. Oh lah. shit! Yeah. Can we, we live in Malaysia? Hey, what happened right? May thirteen? Fuck you. Special right lah. Is that a serious question? No? Dude, I'm not. Brian, I'm not. I'm not well learned. Of Brian, you wanna take this as explanation uh, yeah, yeah. history? I'm yeah, the, yeah. I'm an the the like the the most like the darkest day in. 
Darkest Day in Malaysian. Do you know why it started? Yeah. Why? Um, because DAP won KL. Yeah, yeah. And then they brara. Yeah, yeah. Yes, that was the whole thing. Yeah. So basically, a bunch of people got too happy that um DAP won, and then they kind of brara lah. So that's what happened to them. And then one party thought that was too much. The other party didn't want to back down, and then the country descended into chaos. End of story. Anyways. Yeah. So childish. You know what racism sucks. Politics, lah. Most of the thing is childish. It's politics, lah. You know, you know Hitler's uh, mom oh, wow. or yeah. something was. Oh no, no, one of his exes was, was Jew. half Jewish. Even his friend is full Jew. Right? Who Hitler? Yeah, his yeah, driver is right. a ah. Jew, dude. So it was just him, like, oh, this guy is like hurt my feelings. Yeah, yeah. And, and Let's Jewish. clear them all. Like, yeah. so oh, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Yeah. So basically, he was heartbroken, lah. So he, he was. Yeah. He was just yeah, being childish. You know Hitler's dog. Sorry. You know Hitler's dog. Yeah, he's Jewish as well. Yeah. <laughs> you know, do you see, dude? There's a video of Hitler on. Uh, there's a there's a video. How do Jewish dogs bark? You don't ask. <laughs> how how if you if you can. How does Jewish Shabbat shalom? <laughs> What the fuck is that? <laughs> oh yes, sir. Where the where the come from? Hummus. Can we find? Can we look up? Look it up. Look up. Uh. Jewish dog. Jewish, Jewish dog. <laughs> hey, dude, have you all seen the video of Hitler? This on YouTube, right? This video of Hitler at a uh, Olympic game in the thirties. He's like tweaking. Yeah. Oh yeah, because uh, Germany is losing. <laughs> it, it, oh, is. True, huh? it is true. It is true. Damn. It's because Germany was losing. Hey, dude, I don't. Know, I don't know whether to believe anything. All of you are saying. Okay, Tash, I believe the most. Uh, like, <laughs> like. Can Wait, believe name? which which part? Just anything that you are saying or you are not saying. So I don't. Know. Dude, it's not all in. I learned, dude. You learn what? So wait, so wait, you you learn at school. Like, yeah, what what makes you think that you are unable to believe the things we say? Not we, uh, you mostly. Because you say it straight face, so he yeah. Know. Because your expression is the same yeah, when you say he everything. He the same thing. When you tell a joke, you yeah. have the same expression. Yeah. When you don't tell a joke, yeah. so you have the same expression. Right, yeah. right, right, right. And you're always joking. That's too much, really. Yo, so here's the thing. He yeah. thinks I'm always joking. I think you're always serious. Oh, also no. based on our texts, uh, like our conversations, is oh, just dude, all bullshit. I'm a, I'm a dumb texter. Don't fucking text me. Dude. I, I mean, I'm not, not saying like know. never text yeah, me, yeah, yeah, yeah. but don't yeah, take my busy, texting yeah. as uh, literally as, yeah, yeah. Mm. I'm a very bad text. His te- his texting is like poetry, dude. You yeah, he like he'll he'll, he'll send a knife, but that means yeah. I love you. Okay. So yeah, that's the. That's what it feels like. Yeah. Uh, okay, wants so to cut open yeah, exactly. the borders. The borders of... between you and me. So what makes you think you can't believe him? Whatever he says. Sorry. Yes. Why can't? Why? What makes you think you can't believe? He can him? believe no, me. No, I can't believe Tash the most. Oh. Okay. What about Ashraf then? Ashraf's Ashraf. a straight face as fuck. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Should I have more expression? Yeah. <laughs> Should wear a face mask, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting annoyed, baby. Sorry, dude. <laughs> you should wear a face mask. <clears throat> then you'll trust me more, dude. Oh, that's, that's true, dude. That's true. So we've come to an impasse, like this. Yeah, this is the intermission part, lah. Yes. Oh, really? So Harish yeah. gonna so sing fast, a song. Eh? Oh, it's quick. Yeah, very fast. Ashraf. So what happened that night, lah? Oh, hey, uh, you know that that very. Ashraf, silakan secara terperinci menceritakan apa yang terjadi pada malam itu. Most grim day. So what happened was. That makes sense, dude. Do you remember the date, lah? The day, the date it happened. All I remember it was it was the day before Hari Raya Haji, lah. <laughs> huh? The Serious? day before Hari Raya Haji. Yeah. And okay, here's the thing. Okay, this is something everybody knows. Yep. That video of that girl stripping. Amy. Ah, uh, whole bag. I'm not saying that. Amy, one. what? The whole bag. I'm not saying her name, lah. I will tap that. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> he can't say because he will get in trouble, like. Yeah, dude. No, <laughs> I'm involved. <laughs> No, he said he'll tap that. So I've been trying to fist bump him for the past ten seconds. Yeah, I haven't looked. Hey, hey, yo, yo, Thanks yo! For Thanks for support, bro. No, he. I didn't want to. Will you be there when I tap that? <laughs> Why? You want him to record or what? You don't know what's cucking, right? Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. I know. I, I'm familiar with the term. I wouldn't. <laughs> what's cucking? Oh, you really don't. Brian, know? you want to take it, Brian? Yeah. So Brian, take basically, it. um, the person who likes to watch the girlfriend or the wife get fucked by another guy. So he would watch our record. Have you watched his porn segment? It's like my oh, hot wife. Oh, I've 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 seen this in like like another podcast, like very fucked up podcast. Al Jazeera. <laughs> What Al Jazeera? The next, cam- next not Al Jazeera. Next not Al Jazeera. My wife. No, dude. <laughs> my wife. My wife. My wife. <laughs> my, oh, that's it. My wife. Yali, my wife. 
Too much, too lazy, too lazy. Is Next. that is that Borat impersonation? Yeah. Yes. My wife. I think Bruno was better, to be honest. Bruno, Bruno oh, the, he was gay, dude. Bruno the, you know what happened? The ending of Bruno. What happened again? I like can't in remember. the fucking wrestling ring. Oh, dude, that that's why I that's think it was so better. That's so real, dude. It's yeah. So real. It it really happened. Of and course. And they had to like fucking like bring protection teams to like, like get them out of. Yeah, there. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. you can't fake that shit, right? Yeah. I like Borat in I like the Sasha Baron Cohen in Sweeney Todd. You watch movie? Was he in Sweeney Todd? Yeah, he was the he was like the guy who will be on stage for a while. He'll drink the piss and shit. Oh no no no! I I, I didn't realize. You know, there's a second Borat, right? Which no one yeah, watched. Borat, yeah, yeah, it's, it's with the daughter kind of thing. I I don't know. I I watched it, but nothing stood out. Or... It's more. Uh, it's very political. It's very political because it put a bit closer to your because towards the end. <laughs> So yeah, hosting back to hosting. Back hosting, yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's uh, natural. Yeah. So so it, towards, what were you saying about n- political? No, towards the end of Borat Two, mm-hmm. they actually outed like one of like Trump's right hand men. Oh. Yeah. So they like, like he really. Uh, Colin Powers. Co- no, no, no. Oh the, yeah, yeah, I remember. The girl, That's... the girl went in acting like he, she she wanted to sleep with the guy. And he like he was like oh really uh, oh he was uh, giving in lah oh shit ah uh, and then they outed her outed him so they like he, him? so she wanted to dude fuck they, Borat. the face the they show the fucking oh, face so she yeah. wanted to fuck Borat no 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 she was like she wanted to fuck la. the she was fishing the politician the politician actual politician oh. this is Trump's right, right hand, hand man I'm not gonna say and then his he said name. yes or something like it he was like he was lying he down he was taking out his shirt politician and they outed him like Kantoi. In the movie, you know, it was on theater. You know, the movie is mostly like kind of they just do real things. People don't know the movies. So the movie, thing. okay, what? But Explain the, Borat, the part again. Yeah. So Borat, the uh, is ba- the filming way of Borat is based on like old Iranian movies. Yes. So Iranian movies, they cannot make like indie movies and then release them. So to get the approval for shooting itself. Yes. They what they do is they shoot it as documentary. So the movie is half reality. Half. And half acting, so only the main actors are actors. So the background, yeah, 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 uh, the, the reactions, the interactions are all. Yeah. Real. So the yeah. reason why they film it like uh, it's kind of like documentation. It's because of that. They reason. cannot get license. Ah, yeah, because yeah. they oh, cannot get license. So Borat, they took the same concept, lah. They mix reality yeah, yeah. and half scripted, half reality. Because they are only able to. To shoot it like that, like documentary, documentary. only yeah. kind of documentary. <laughs> But Borat, like there wasn't the restriction from the government kind of shit, lah. The Iranian films, yes, they were really restricted by the government. Okay, okay. So these guys, like Borat, like they, he just took the film concept, lah. So he went around, like he pranked, he went and like he went to a, a like this redneck kind of rally, yep. and then he went up there and started singing about gay people. And shit. Wow! But they got angry, dude. They started throwing shit at him. He had to run away. Wow! This is the first one or second? Second one, second one. Okay, right. I don't remember the the much yeah. of the second one. Nice. Wait, what do you say happened at um at at the end of the second one? The politician. So the so in the movie, yes. the daughter will marajo with Borat. So the uh, the daughter was spoiler. Uh, yeah. What is the spoiler. daughter's uh, relation oh, with Borat? Yeah, daughter lah. You say daughter. So so no so uh, in Kazakhstan no 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 Borat's, it's Borat's daughter. daughter. So in the second movie. Daughter. Is it yeah, yeah, in the in the movie lah? Yeah yeah yeah. Not, yeah, yeah. Not oh I remember Baron. she's a little whore. Ah yeah yeah yeah. 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 She, she, she 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 was raised in a cage. It's oh, fucking funny, dude. Stupid, in yeah. Kazakhstan, no, they will like exaggerate how women are treated. There. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fair <laughs> enough. It's all true, dude. <laughs> yeah. It's all true. Uh. But it's honestly, true. how bad does that movie make Kazakhstan people look, right? Dude, okay, here's what happened to Shasha Baron Cohen. The Af- Af- Minister of Tourism, car. Yeah, that's what happened in uh, after the first, first movie, movie came yeah, out. They actually the, the Ministry of Tourism of Kazakhstan called. No, no, no. They they called Shasha Baron Cohen. To make another one. To no, to come to Kazakhstan and see that what you what you portrayed about us is not real, mm-hmm. and uh, Sa- Sasha just made fun of it. He's the ultimate comedian. Bro. Comedian lah, yeah. in that sense, he doesn't give a fuck lah. Yeah. Yeah. What are uh, you gonna do? B- basically, what he do- he's doing is no one has done that. Yeah, he's just outing Satire, people. He's acting yeah. dumb. Yeah. So that other people, uh, like. But when taking fucking a award, it's like I, I put I what was it? I I let a man fuck me or I fucked a fat man for this. I better fucking get this award. Uh, he sounds so professional. 
when he takes the fucking award and stuff. Is this in the movie or no? No, no, no. When he got an award, award for, for movie, Borat, for Borat, he came up and then he was like, "I let a fat man sit on my face. I better fucking get an award for this." Yeah, yeah, yeah. So professional, like, like whoa, Bagatana. where the fuck is Borat? Borat, where is that? <laughs> no, Start but the thing the is, whatever he has done, it's actually uh, like it could risk his life. Yeah, he's he doesn't. Sure. He is, but he knows crazy. Bro. Yeah, he, he doesn't care. Lots of balls, dude. Yeah. I mean, two lah, but it's not like what was the one in which award one he he uh, spilled the the um, the remains of his grandfather onto that Ryan guy? Which award? I forgot this one. He but like, I know one where he wins the uh, Charlie Chaplin's uh, cane. You know, uh-huh. he gets Charlie Chaplin's cane and comedy the, awards. The, the one, uh, so the one that presented. Was one of the actresses that acted with uh, Charlie Chaplin, okay. so he was like he was acting like Charlie Chaplin lah. He was acting oh. like Charlie Chaplin on the stage. So you know how Charlie Chaplin like leans on his uh, yeah, cane, cane, right? Yeah. So he leans like that. He did that, and the cane broke. The cane broke. He fell on. He accidentally pushed the lady, the yeah, act, yeah. the actress. She yeah, was yeah. on the wheelchair. Yeah. Pushed her off stage. And she, she fell down. Fell down. So it was a whole bit where uh, he accidentally killed this lady. Oh, oh, he, no, no, no. She, she was in on the bit, lah. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So okay, okay, it was okay, like okay. the whole. So thing. they actually broke Charlie Chaplin's cane, or was cane, it like a fake cane? I think I hope fake it's fake, cane, lah. I hope it's fake, lah. Right. The was fuck? was that in the movie? No, 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 no. no, no, no it's like a award, award, award uh, show. Uh-huh. Ah, so they kind of you know award shows they kind of do bits all try to make people laugh. Yeah. So his bit was when he got the cane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He leans on it, breaks it, pushes it off the stage, like yeah, yeah. I'm just trying to see if you understand. Yeah, I don't understand. So. Hey, so back to the crack. Yes. Ah, I'm untrustworthy. Who is it? Not me. So I crack house. I trust house. you completely, bro. Yeah. Where were we? Crack house, bro. Yes, crack house, bro. So, so I was. You were in crack house. Bro. Ashraf is uh has been uh stand up comic for the last two years. Two yes, years. yes. Okay. Now he's a big timer opening for <laughs> yes. big names. The fastest rising opening in Southeast Asia. Yes, fastest. Southeast Asia. Fastest yeah. growing. Southeast Ampang. Okay. Southeast <laughs> Southeast Klang lah. Within two years, opening for the biggest names in yes. Malaysia in KL. Yes. Jason Leong, Harish. Yes. Douglas Lee. <laughs> I've never opened. Trust me, doesn't sound as corny as that, but it's all true. Yeah, it's yeah. true. Yeah. I never yeah. opened Varish. So you never opened Varish. My wow. career, I haven't made it yet, lah. <laughs> wait, wait, you open for who? Jason Leong or, or Douglas? Jason, Jason Leong, Leong, Douglas, uh, Kevin, Fakafas, Mataba, Mataba. Who is the first one you opened for? The, the first person I opened for was Brian Tan. Okay, I that's heard my heard. first opening. How did you feel when you opened for him? Oh, when, uh, you, when you heard of the news that you're going to open for him, how did you feel? Okay, so it was the how, day... How many minutes was it? Uh, five minutes. So how did you feel opening. when you got the news? Like, okay, I'm opening for... Dude, myself. I was fucking happy, dude. Yeah, Damn happy. I was like... It's something I targeted. Because before then, yeah. I was only getting open mic spots like w- once every two months. That's not why, huh? Uh, last I, I time... Mean, all, uh, two months, yeah, yeah. Eh? Like, once like, every two months, why? Yeah, like now, it's you. the rotation system actually... It's very rotate, fair. Uh, yeah, but yeah. last time, last all, time was very hard. Very, very hard. Wait, are you only talking like, about crack house or... Crack, or uh, both, both. But why, what, what was the reason the last time? Like, it's just like... Corruption. That, that, yeah, corruption. I don't know. Like, I, I, was, yeah, I yeah, didn't yeah. experience it as much to talk about it. Okay, okay. Sure. So it's just my early stage. Let's just leave it stage. at he only got spots every two months. Yeah, yeah they didn't months. like him before. Now they like him now. Nah, yes. because they yes. didn't know me. How you like me now? Yeah. Because now you prove your worth uh, and the corporation so wants you back. You should hire you know, him to be your fucking publicist. He's contributed yeah, a lot dude. to this. Yeah. What? Ashraf has contributed a lot to this. What? Of course, yes. Of course. You've shown a lot of, of progress of in course, such yes. a short span of time. No one takes you seriously. <laughs> finish, finish, letter, finish, letter. Can I have it? <laughs> Finish that. Bro, how dare you? Finish. This is my <laughs> idol, dude. <laughs> 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 he says he's fucking. That, that's is that uh, right? Okay, no, okay. Here, here's the story about how I like was fascinated by Harish. Yes. Like, so okay, Harish for me, was, hey, Harish. Fuck. One day, Harish took out his shirt. Yes. <laughs> and they were like, "Oh, wow!" Let him speak. Okay, let him speak. Okay, let him speak. Let him speak. Harish wants to know. Yeah. You watch Kung Fu also. <laughs> Okay, second question later. Okay, now Harish wants Harish needs an ego boost. Tell first. Oh my god! You know what? Let's talk later. Lah. No, no, no. Okay, no, no. Tell that. What is your question again? No, you say the story how you got fascinated oh, yeah. by so, this guy called Harish. When I entered the scene, I didn't know the scene was as complex as it is. I thought it was just like, like I thought everybody was like Hare, Jason, like the the ones that I saw on YouTube, lah, oh, the big name. So you didn't know the there layers to it, lah. There was like different styles of comedy. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. Okay. And then I, but at the time I, I'm, I'm exposed to like the US, like Western comedy. So I'm familiar with this guy called Anthony Jeselnik. Yeah, yeah. So the first time I saw Harish, 
I was like, fuck, this exists in Malaysia. Why his style is similar to Justin? Sti- uh, his style is, is the same to Anthony Justin Nick. Yeah. I thought dark. He, Justin Nick is dark, but Justin Nick has much more energy. But but, but the he tone, energy. the just, tone. Ah, he's just straight face. The yeah, tone. Yeah, it's it's. I mean, okay, yeah. Justin yeah, Nick, what? But he does something like what Justin Nick. Justin Nick like that has like that sinister smile. After after saying after like a saying dark way, dark joke. Like I didn't watch much shit. of uh, Justin Nick. I watched once only, but I, so you watch more Harish than Justin Nick. Yeah, definitely. Bro, yeah, that's Jason. weird. You know, I never. It is weird. <laughs> He's Jewish, like what? So I I rarely I know of him. Like I've seen his roles, but I've never really yeah. Studied usually, his. usually you you how to say ah uh, you you become the style that you're not you're least familiar with. Is that true? <laughs> Dude, I, I never like, heard that before, man. No, no. I, mean, I like, feel like that. Like if you, it's normal, dude. Like if, you, uh, like if you come and ask me like some random comedian, mm-hmm. then I'll be like, dude, your style is like that. Like I wouldn't know. Yeah, fair enough. Because, like, because if I knew he, uh, there's a style out there like that, I wouldn't do it. Like as oh, a genuine comedian, okay, 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 okay. You like know, gen- only because like you do, uh, because that. I don't want to have like other people stick. So okay, so that was your um, fascination towards Harish uh, lah. Okay, Harish, why were you fascinated by Ashraf? No, he's hardworking, resourceful, yes. uh, man of many skills also. Tall, tall, the tall. Yeah, he's blushing. Dude, this fucking blushing. He's only done comedy for two years. Now he's hosting his he's own hosting shows. Hosting, yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, I, 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 I was well, the like. first to highlight that, bro. Yeah, <laughs> he hosts damn well now, by the way. Yeah, I, I know, dude. I watched him do a cold room. Well, well, didn't didn't even give a shit about who the fuck was there, and then half an hour later, everybody was talking to him. So it's because he's tall, lah. That's why he's confident. Yeah, tall, lanky, handsome, bald. <laughs> Some girls like lah. Don't lah. Some. Uh. Speaking of girls, ah, uh, started lah. Is it true that you've never had a girlfriend? I've had a girlfriend, but I'm still. Uh, oh, you've had a girlfriend? I saw on your girlfriend Insta story the Q and A. Huh? Girlfriend with benefit with benefits. No benefits. No benefits. No benefits. No benefits are, uh, what he's saying when he says he has a girlfriend or had a girlfriend, he has lots of wallpapers at home. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. So have you ever had a girlfriend? I've had a girlfriend, but uh, how to say? Uh, it was very halal la, the relationship. We didn't go out on dates. Your cousin, ah? No, of course not. Haven't married, but bro. No, but you can. <laughs> what's okay? What's a halal relationship? It's like very halal, dude. There's no Within no the holding, la. no hand holding. Oh. Oh, in accordance to uh, Sharia, Sharia. Sharia, Sharia law. Okay, okay, law then. La. Did she meet your family? Uh no, but we've introduced each other to each other's parents. Eight years. Oh shit! What the fuck happened? And then she broke up on me or uh, with me on me. <laughs> Fair enough. Can as well. She break. She Why broke she up. Why she became liberal? What is this? No, I that is one of my speculations. Really? Wow. Okay. That is one of my speculations. Okay. Uh, but uh, why I because the reason is this was she told me lah, so she said her family couldn't. Uh, except that I'm doing comedy. Uh, yeah. Uh, so I at that moment like <laughs> this. What? Wait. Yeah, dude. dude wait. She's, you sure she's not Chinese family? Or? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Maybe la, her yeah. Family all look like Chinese. Me all mother. What? <laughs> next. <laughs> <laughs> Go next. Yeah. So. Uh, do you still do you still miss her? <laughs> no, no. I I moved on, dude. I this I'm on. Okay. Okay. Sure, man. Oh, nice. Okay. Cool. Yeah, he's on my ex now. <laughs> Now he's he's on his ex, not on like <laughs> he's on the trail. <laughs> I want no la like she she like we we matched and then, and then you she matched. Told you, she told you I matched with his ex on Bumble. On Bumble, fuck, in the all bots only Dude, I tell you this right, I I use dating app for apps for so long right. I don't like I can't match with Indian girls you know. Why you I, can't or you don't? No, want? I I can, but it's very little. Check your preference. No, yeah, no, check no. Your preference. preference. No, what no, do you mean no. Check my preference. No, check but... your location, bro. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Yo, uh, well, yeah. Where are you opening? 10, where 10 are you? Ten KM. Ten KM. Ten KM. Yeah, ten KM. So no Indians in ten KM. Nah, no, okay. don't. Yeah. No, like I match with Indians, but it's very rare. Very rare. Is it because Indian girls don't like Chinese guys? No, no. la. Indian girls like them. dating apps. They do what? They don't so, like dating. Are you serious? Yeah. They use matrimony. Wait, wait, they don't like what? They use matrimony. Use matrimony. dot com. What do you say? Facts. They don't like dating apps. The Indian girls don't like dating apps. Why? Because uh, scared of. I don't know the... how many Indian girls gonna come after you, but you will sell tickets anyways, lah. So. Hey, bro, have you ever thought about this? Of uh, Bollywood movies, right? Uh-huh. The hot girls are always light skin. Yeah, but that it's not not the Indian dude. They're all Indian. fair. If this if if that shit was America, right, people are gonna start complaining, right? Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. why India is India, lah, bro. And America. There's is something America. they say like the less privileged is the country a... is. Sorry. Go on, the the less privileged the com- the country is, the less PC people are. 
because they don't have they don't have time to give a fuck. Because they got real yeah. problem, bro. Yeah, they got Life real problems. Shit. The fuck yeah. I worry about. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so the real problem thing has to go, dude. It's not real. I problem. know. I'm not saying it's correct. Also, but it's the truth. If you go to a place of suffering, you go and tell them, "What do you think about me wearing your religious cultural clothes?" They'll be like, "Bitch, I need to eat tonight, lah." Yeah. The fuck I care about what you're wearing. Yeah. Fuck I don't got no food. Yeah, that's true, lah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's the truth of the world. You can't say you can't sit there and say, "I want you to go away." Yeah, you can. Idealistic you can thinking. go to a country that's lower than us and ask about the same problems we have. Yeah, first world problems are first world problems. Sure. Very insightful, the Ashraf. Is really <laughs> like what? The government loves us. This is Let's Get It podcast. We want to tell you that we support Malaysia. We love Malaysia. Anyways, I love the government. Next month you're gonna get uh, supporting sponsorship, bro. Yeah. You can, you can. Elections can. coming. Everybody gets sponsored. Yes, sir. He's podcast. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the summon summon <laughs> discounts. Discount. Who are you voting for? I choose to not vote because mm-hmm. I cannot be fucked. You can't be. Yeah, you can't. I can't be asked to do it. Like kind of thing. Uh, are you offended by that? No, I don't understand that. No, he can't be fucked. Can't yeah. be bothered. Yeah, do you oh, are you going to vote? No. Are you then why do you give me that face like I'm No, he's just asking. This, this is my face. That's his face. Dude. I'm puzzled. Okay. I'm puzzled, yeah. Okay. That's his face, dude. Uh-huh. Are you going to vote? I don't know yet. I feel like I should. But they would they allow you to vote? Uh, if I find my leg back like thing, well. Like, <laughs> I mean, can I, I'm pretty sure can lah, like, but we'll see lah. Like. Are you going to vote, Ashraf? I might not. Might not. Like maybe not this round lah. Like. Should we no, go no, back no. to Quick House? <laughs> not this round. <laughs> see, shall we go back to Quick House? <laughs> yeah, yeah, talk about. I'd rather do. If you vote, most likely who would you vote for? How many parties are there? <laughs> I don't know, like, but I know the famous yeah, one. Uh, you know the the mainstream ones. The mainstream, ones, uh, probably Muda lah. Muda, Muda is under uh, Pakatan now. Yeah, but then. So you vote specifically for Muda. Uh, uh, as fucked up as it is. If you're the, gay, will you fuck Sorry, sorry. No. sorry. Bro, come on. Bro. If I was gay, I, I would I, know. Okay, that. let's be honest. I think anybody would look at for him. the right price. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Look yeah. for what? the right price. For What's the your right price? Thirty five bucks, sir. Ten k month. See, this is what I said. Ten k thing is not so or not. So or not. Gary, this is individual, lah. Not a fucking Gary. How much would you charge? Million, right? Yeah. There. That's Hong Kong Bank, dude. Doesn't matter. For him, Chef Sadik is Hong Kong Bank. Yeah. You dude. weren't there when the conversation was happening. <laughs> I, I was, was here. La. This is the problem with Indian. It just because I zoned out doesn't mean I was there. I wasn't there. You wasn't there. What? <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, so uh, Ashraf, what happened that night, man? You were there during Crack House, right? Like, I, I mean, you were there at Crack House when that incident happened, okay. where Amy and Alex, the infamous mm. incident, Duo. where she, yeah. So what happened was, uh, these were newbies. These two people, the Alex and uh, the bitch. Rumbo, rumbo, joke, man. Can I tell you? Okay, okay. So she, she, they were newbies, lah. They first timers doing open mic. It was a Saturday afternoon open mic, 5 p.m. And they came. I, I was only hosting the second half. The first half, another host okay, sure. hosted. They came on second half. Or? They came on second half. So the, uh, the guy who handled them. Told me, okay, second half got this couple. They want to go back to back. Usually, when there's newbies, like two newbies in the second half, yeah. or if in the same half, we put them between comics. Okay. So like experienced comics, lah. Yeah. Like, uh, so the flow is better. Ah, uh, flow is better. Yeah, so for it, the show. it's not. It's it. Does, it's not a very, very steep fall. Yep, yep. Uh, you don't check their material, so because uh, you you should be responsible. So well. okay, here's the thing about a lot of people uh saying about the crackers thing. Why you never screen them before yes. before the they yes. get on stage? Yep. The thing is in stand up comedy, the screening process is open mic. Yes. Is open it, mic is the screening process. Yeah, you have process. to understand it's underground com. Uh, scene. It, it, like in it singing, should not be recorded. Exactly. Yep. If like this is an open mic singing thing, the the person is not gonna come. What song you singing? How you singing? What you doing? Don't do that. They're not going to do that. It's an open thing, open mic. You're going to do it. That's why you learn what to say, what not to say, mm. right? Continue. Based on the uh, the judges are the the audience, audience, the comedians, uh. and all that, right? So it's an open thing. It's an underground thing. Understand uh. that. And people people be like, oh, why are there people paying tickets for? Yeah, because it's also a business. Uh, so okay, well that one thing. Yeah. But there is a community out there that loves to come out on weekdays to watch. To pay people and watch. Uh, pay and watch these people trying out their new material. Yes. I, I, I like they that like thing. the awkwardness. Yeah. It's a different kind of magic. I always yeah. laugh when the joke is not uh, funny. Yeah, because it's awkward. That, it's the yeah. best, bro. Yeah. So in an open mic, there's always like two different laughters. Dude, one from the audience and one from dude, the comics. Dude, that time. Dude, that time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fair enough, fair enough. Dude, that time I went right. There was this dude. You all know Bing. 
Uh, yeah. Yeah, Bing. Yeah. So Bing was doing a singing uh, a bit. Yeah. yeah, a singing bit. Uh. I think he sang one song and he ended up singing three songs uh, for his whole set. I remember I, I sat down there and it was quite quiet. You know, I went to the toilet and I come back and he's still singing <laughs> and everyone is still quiet. But of course, it's just a new bit. Uh, trying yeah, to it's bits. It's yeah. a new thing. Most of it's going to be awkward. Some of it's going to be damn nice. Some of it's going to be like, oh my God, it looks like it's polished already. Yeah, so I had fun. Yeah, so continue. That shit happened. La. So and the, I, I told them the three things. But this the thing was, we didn't have it on paper. Yep, I, yep. T- I actually told them, don't talk about royalty. Don't talk about race, so religion. She ca- you met up with them. You actually met up with Amy or Amy and, uh, and Alex, Alex. Both before the show. Yep. So they were smoking downstairs yep. during the break. And I told them, la, as, as, uh, because I just came, and I, I, I was telling them. And then they went up. The first, the, the guy went up. The husband. He wasn't even the husband. He's the boyfriend. Yeah, boyfriend. I discovered that in the police station. <laughs> okay. I, we were telling the husband. They were like, Siapa <laughs> husband dia? The, the guy lah. was like, no, no, itu bukan husband. Huh? Yeah, I was like, what? Wait, wait, are you serious about this part? Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Not husband. We discovered that... She actually has a husband. No, she doesn't. She, uh, like that guy... He's Alexa. not legally married. Yeah, he's not legally Did married. Did they say that she, they were married? They didn't, right? She they, they refers to, to him. Told people, uh, she yeah. refers to him as. He watched husband. a YouTube video or Insta stuff. All it's yeah. she referred to him as husband. So mm. like, so you were, she went up on stage. She you went you went adjust the mic for her. So why I was involved in the case? He started recording. She got on stage. She got on stage already. She got on stage, and then. Uh, she was short la, so she couldn't reach the mic I forgot to adjust the mic yeah, before yeah, I got yeah. you being the tall so guy so I went yeah. back and I took out the mic I'll help you off <laughs> let me help you no, let me help you gentleman with a strong arm yeah. do you want the mic young lady <laughs> yeah, do you want the- get on your knees <laughs> god damn next okay, <laughs> oh, shit, okay no. next yeah. so I gave her the mic and then she then she did what she did la, dude People think like there was more to what the video was. That that's was all. The, that's what, three minutes. Whatever had not even three minutes. One minute something. Then she left. Ah, and then she so she basically on. came to sabotage the night. Yeah. Not even do open mic. Like. Yeah. But to her, right? She honestly, I mean, to her lah. She had no idea this was going to be this controversial. No, I think, I I think, think, think she, knew. she knew. Yeah, I think, I she, think knew. she knew. They, they are not, this is not the first time they're doing this, you know. Apparently, they did the same thing. They tried to do it with, in Merde Karya. They didn't expect to pay 40k. Or. <laughs> what happened? 40,000? 40, 40, yeah, they, they, they were fine like, 40k. Like, like, oh, shit. Okay. Uh, yeah. That was because apparently something happened there and then they tried to do the same thing there and then the owners shut them out and then they started like And, um, and they got them. away with it just with the 100 ringgit. Fine, uh, fine, yeah. What the Madikarya one uh, is it? Oh, the forty k one. What is the story? Forty k one is the one uh, for bail, twenty k, twenty k, and they managed to get the bail. Got supporters, bro. Got supporters. Got supporters. Bro, people yeah. funded their bail money. Yeah, they yeah, have bro. a cult, bro. It's like a thing. It's like their own swingers club thing. Dude, uh, okay, like the, I f- I feel like what led to the most fucked up thing this incident was the fact that Rizal and Crack House Comedy Club had to shut down. Yeah. And not only that, results license to open any business yeah. in KL. Is it? I don't Malaysia? think it's lawfully in KL, la, in KL. Yeah, in KL. I don't think it's a lawfully real thing, but yeah. continue. He and and that that person who issued that ban doesn't even have the jurisdiction. No, but you can't even do that. It's just apparently. some dude, ah. dude chilling at home. But you can't even do that apparently. Like you can't even block someone. Like, this guy just thing. typed out a letter and ah. published oh, it. Oh, so okay, it was okay, a okay. very religiously driven thing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. Political lah. Uh, Politically, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Okay, okay. So, so you're, you're saying that um, in actual fact, result can actually open another business. He should be able to. I mean like... Legally. Law? Legally, legally lah. Like, still allowed law, to. I don't understand. I mean, he can go to KL and open. Like, he got banned in Slango, is it? KL. Oh, so he can go to Slango and open. DB KL. DB KL. So he can go to Slango and open. Yeah. Um, okay. But dude, the, the crazy thing is like, if you were to put out a statement like this, right? And saying that you want to ban Rizal. Okay, so just... Rizal has been in comedy scene for what? 13 years? 11 years? Yeah. Right? So you, you already know how fucking hard it is to do... To be in the creative art scene in Fair Malaysia. Enough. Okay? Yeah. The dude Rizal spent... 11 years or more than 10 years devoted to this shit, right? Yeah. I'm sure there's easier routes out there he could have taken. Yes, in yeah, Malaysia, yeah. everyone knows that if you are someone who speaks English, right, most people are going to, of course, consume English content from overseas, uh, first yeah, of all, than, right? Yeah. It's very hard. It's a, it's a tough thing to do. So he spent, what, 10 years of his life doing this shit, you know, and the running crack house, seven years it's been running. And for them to just ban him for something that he has absolutely no control over. That's not over. why they banned him. No, no, no. The, it wasn't the fact that it was Amy. So, 
when they the when they went to the police station to give yeah. a statement and everything apparently the first day they were nice to you guys because they the, were always nice until the end even the yeah. both cases they they no, but the, because I mean, we were giving cooperation right, right but the second day they were like because results videos came out yeah. and then they were like oh see so you guys are also doing this thing kind of thing but see the logic is this you you want to look at a comedian who's doing jokes religious royalty okay fine doing that those those stuff as a as a comedy thing right and what he said was one of his jokes was about during school they said uh, non bumis go to hell that no is, no 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 uh, non no, one of the videos non muslims go to ah, hell ah non muslims sorry non and, and it's boy. true dude it is true it is true i'm indian he's indian wait wait a- so they are that was the problem they had with him because not only said, that it was a couple of videos that came out three videos okay. he got banned he got attacked because he said that on stage what did he say muslims go to uh, uh, agama class uh, non muslims Muslims go go to to hell hell. because a joke but in reality in school yes i've heard muslim kids tell me that my own friends have told me that ustadas have told them see i'm not trying to say right or wrong here there's no right or wrong here my point is if you're going to ban him for saying that then why didn't you ban politicians who talk shit about non bumis uh why didn't you attack zakir naik for saying that you know uh, hindu scriptures are fake he says all these things are but none of that happens right so If you're not mad at that, don't get mad at this. I'm not saying right or wrong here. What I'm saying is logic. Look at logic, right? If you can shut down a man who's joking about a real situation, given that you're offended by what they say, or he or they or she say, and then you should look here as well and get offended as well. I have, uh, dude, honestly, I've heard that multiple times growing up from just friends, you know, when you're in primary and like they would say that, isn't that what um, they believe? which is non muslim yeah so i, I mean I, in the book like yes yeah, like, but then you, face, sorry, so why can't like, you say uh, that like on stage people, if it's if it's written let's, let's ask the muslim let's ask the muslim so the thing is it's something that the agama teachers okay. just say this is purely just story yeah huh? experience not, experience, right? huh? experience don't please fucking this attack is us my experience for fuck sake because okay. my school the indian malay Chine, the the capacity the the what the p- pecahan red right? yes, indian yes, malay yes. chinese the composition is, uh, the composition is the same so uh, it was equal so there were more non muslims in my school okay. so non muslims stay in the class mm-hmm. only muslims go for agama class yeah. uh, outside course, the different different class like usually in like go more, library, yeah. more like majority muslim schools only the moral students go out to another they class. combine other class lah uh, so a and b will uh, combine and go and do moral so, class so lah so this one not many people understand lah so We all will go to different class. So when we are in that class, the teacher will literally tell us, dude, like you guys, uh, okay, wh- whoever believes, in, yep, yep. Uh, whoever ucap do kalimah shada, who who's Islam, who has iman, is going to heaven. Like even like if you do bad things, you will go yeah. to hell. And then when your judgment ends, you, you go, go to, to heaven. heaven. But if you're so, non-Muslim, but if you're non-Muslim, you until the end you don't believe. Because you're not a believer. The, uh, you're not not a believer. Yeah. Just end up in hell. This is scriptures, lah. This is scriptures, Based but but scriptures. In, even in the scriptures, if like you are like if you live your life good, but until the end, also you didn't believe in the one true God. Yeah. Uh, you tend to go you, to hell. You 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 won't get the same. The, God is fair. In in Islam, yeah yeah. God is fair. Like even he, he views everyone individually. Like they, he doesn't group you. Okay. Ah, uh, so okay. that's what is in the scriptures. Right. How these teachers. Uh, kind of interpret it and misinterpret it is simplify it, yeah. uh, and simplify it and make it into like a racism propaganda yeah yeah is like they say like to just to make them avoid non muslim students and right. don't be friends with them yeah. That's all. That's all. These are all experiences that we can see ah. and talk about it for the whole This day. This is my experience. Yeah. My ustaza literally told me that all your non muslim friends are going to hell. <laughs> you are Indian muslim you know. That's the best I'm part. Indian muslim you know. Yeah yeah. Uh, okay one thing like they don't know that shit they like this flow so like he thought i was malay mix and everything okay. so uh, yeah i'm full indian bro yeah, I'm full indian, for i'm full okay. full breed so <laughs> wait was was that was that the main why oh, harish no no continue continue was What's that the main the main reason why um um result going to a lot of trouble yeah because of that statement I yeah the statement this is three videos inside. what what i was telling just now is just the insights of it So it's true. There are two what other videos. He, he what he's saying is things that are happening to Islam Muslim students in Malaysia. There's another video where he speaks in Tamil. Yes. And what he says is like he's basically appealing to the Indian crowd. This is what politicians do when they do their campaigns and stuff all, okay? You can watch videos. I don't want to drop names because I want to, you know, be free. 
but so they, what they do is they throw shit like oh if we let these people run the country we will be out of land and they do all this shit yep. political campaigns bro yep. people are watching running for fucking state government what are the fuck seat they're doing this it's a comedian on stage appealing to the indian crowds doing exactly what indians do to indians if me and nashav and harish sit somewhere and we don't like someone coming that's what we'll do we we'll do the same thing and the person doesn't understand tamil we we'll speak in tamil like that because it's jokes we're roasting them basically it doesn't mean he hates fucking indians no right so i mean it, the whole thing got to cut a context and then now all we need is to lost. do is just miss him to predict yes. one message and the day it's us we are viewing it so if if you want us like if you want things to be bet- be better in the country then we have to be better we have to interpret it properly right yeah. we have to be smart if i watch a one minute video i'm not going to be like oh that's the whole thing no i just want to like what what is he talking about we have to be smarter that's all brian brian told me he wa- he said like or oh, two episodes very serious ready oh. so that's why he brought three comedians to make the episode more fun you know we <laughs> <laughs> this is the one you got to cancel for hey, this is still this is not conf- considered not serious at all man uh. like, compared to the last two Okay. Yeah, there, there was there was another one where um he said Malay people are lazy. Is it is that the, why he got in trouble? Oh no 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 that one he didn't. Yeah. Actually, millennials are lazy. That's for a good reason. Look look no 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 even the okay let let's okay let's just say he did. I'm like, lazy dude. I'm lazy. We all lazy. Yes, look at this. Let's just say let's that that was the problem. Let's get it, bro. Let's let, get it. No, let's get lazy. Let's just say that's the problem. Okay. <laughs> Let's say the result said Malay Salih Zin. That's why he got into trouble. Politician said the same thing. Mahathir told the same thing about about when um, banks, why banks don't want to loan money to Malay people and all that because mm. he explicitly said, "Ah, eh, mm. this was in newspapers, TV, yeah. everything, right? Why are we getting mad when someone that we cannot touch says it? But then when someone who's just doing it for jokes and trying to highlight something funny, what if he was doing it just to make fun of the fact that people seriously use that sentence? See again, no context." someone we look at someone who's powerful they say it like oh lord how can you say it then we walk away because we can't touch them right yeah. but if someone touchable we're like oh you know what i want to exercise power let's cancel this guy let's attack this guy it doesn't make sense what is this no to them it makes sense you know why cuz it is their ego lah no all the pent up anger and feelings if they they want to like direct it to mother they can't do it yeah. so like no what let's let's find another person no, let's like, yeah. keep good and we're not just yeah. exclusive, uh, they're not going to talk about they're talking about tune a lot of politicians like if we if we start naming now we'll go to jail first and then we'll finish yeah. right so i mean we have to be smarter then they we have to be smarter and we are slowly we are becoming smarter but another 50 years la, i hope we'll see la. yeah and for those who hate harvin skin you got look back <laughs> you What? don't yeah for those who hate harvin skin out there you, you actually don't hate harvin skin You, you probably hate, hate, you hate the idea. You hate the idea of her. No, skin. they probably hate someone else, like another okay. politician. Oh, okay. Uh, probably so Rina Harun. They're directing the hate, directing the hate like all his pent up anger. Yeah, like, so like, like, maybe they hate their parents. <laughs> yeah, right? you never know. They uh, probably. Ah, became somebody that he wants to join. Ah, they could probably hate Rina Harun as well. And Who's Rina Harun again? Ah, Menteri Pembangunan Wanita Doremon. Yeah, so she she's been doing nothing. Wanita Doremon. Nothing but nothing. You say Wanita Doremon? That's fucking dope. Everything she's been doing, like if she does ten things, seven would be wrong. Somehow she's, she's still the menteri pembangunan wanita. So I'm saying, like, what is this obsession in with attacking people that we can somehow touch and then leaving them? Right. So it's so stupid. You want to talk about religiously talk talking shit about religious things, bro? This country has history, bro. Right. We can't just point at one one point and say, oh, gee, he did this. No, then he did this. Then she did this. Then they did this. Like. No, we can't keep doing this. Come on, man. What the fuck? You're okay, Brian. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> Brian's like, we gonna die, man. We gonna die. We gonna die, bro. <laughs> any minute, any minute, swat is just gonna. No, 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 no. Come with the PDRF. Ni apa ni? Kopi, Old Town kan? Korang minum Old Town. Ah, ini section. Asal tak minum Tongkali. It's very racist, lah. Brian, any more questions? You watch that uh the video of uh Jordan Peterson getting. Like ambushed by the gender, gender neutral community yeah, in yeah. his in his campus, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The first that's that's why he became famous, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. the first. Video. There's just a man who's standing there saying what he wants to he say. He was yeah. just walking back. From <laughs> yeah, yeah, Pity yeah. The blood, dude. Yeah, I just admire Can his tenacity. Like, no, his patience. He just yeah. dude, he's a lecturer, clinical psychologist. Of course, he's going to be fucking patient. Half right? his age, you know, talking to people half your age. Yeah, and they have no respect and for him. And people who still like annoy you, and he like actually takes it in. Because he knows Then if he reacts, it'll become a yeah. thing. So he's like, you know what? I know what to do here. Yeah. I'm just gonna be cool. You please shut. I know you're angry. Go ahead. Like yo, 
Jordan Peterson should be a UFC fighter. He can win fights by just talking to his opponent. You know, you know what? So come on, when the opponent will do you really break want down to do that? and just <laughs> like <laughs> start crying, is that gonna solve and the then problem? Rapsi's like, <laughs> "I'm gonna break your face." Of course, you're gonna break my face. That's yeah. what you're trained to do. So as a masculine man, like, what the fuck? You gotta be a monster. Why are you entering? Whoa, 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 whoa. You gotta be a monster. He's telling his referee, like he's attacking me inside. <laughs> inside. So he just he's, cover up. Yeah, so oh, he's, oh, he meets oh, his takedowns hundred percent, man. He's take down 100%. <laughs> 100 wins, 0 KO. Dude, that'll be legend, dude. Bro, he'll be a legend. He'll be Yo, the fighter who's in the fight. You know who's the like. first person you should fight? John Jones, dude. Who's that John Jones? Is, the that guy is the good, no, the but he's so insecure. Are you talking about they're me talking, going to the UFC? They're talking... You watch uh, UFC, yeah? Uh, I know. Okay, they're, 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 they're talking... I just watch Jordan Peterson, dude. That's the UFC fight you watch, Jordan Peterson. Did you all see that the Cambodia cyber scam shit, though? What happened? Oh, you all didn't see? Okay, wait, Cambodia? Cyber, cyber scam. scam. Cyber? Al Jazeera, they posted Cambodia and cyber scam. Cambodia cyber scam. Yeah. Got cyber in Cambodia. God. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle what is a server, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle what is in Thailand. Yeah. Uncle what is in Cambodia. Cambodia. Thailand. Uh. Cambodia. No, he, you know what he said? Uh, Uncle what is a server. Uncle what is a uh, server building, you know? <laughs> server building. Inside, it's all uh, Apple, Apple products, lah. <laughs> Okay. Got machines there. Got machines. <laughs> that's the shit. That's where you got the shit from, lah, bro. Yeah, I wanted to wear the shit today. Uh, hey, what's up? Get out, get out. Wear Android shit. Dude, you guys really never heard about that, lah. No, bro. Dude, what happened? We don't know cyber things. You know when you get those messages like, oh, uh, Shopee, part-time job. Oh, that's Cambodia oh, cyber that's scam. Cambodia. Yeah, I mean, for so, example. For example. So Macau scam, then now Cambodia cyber scam. The Macau scam. Those people that are ah, from that, Macau, that, right? Yeah, that they are doing the scam in yeah, Macau. Yeah. Yes. They, they ban it so the restrictions uh they, basically they, the authorities have a, a like a good watch on it already so they are they not able to hub la. yeah they move it to so Cambodia. it's the same thing just to suck same, same shit place, bro they took a flight there nice dude you know what's the crazy thing oh? the the scam central right the building where they hold the people hostage oh yeah they... to, do, to do the scamming right and then there's videos of them um if they don't want to they don't hit their kpi they just beat them mm-hmm. they use the taser and taste them right so there's videos of all that shit so that that hub where they bro is fucked up so this scam hub is located right in right next to the president's office in cambodia and they wow. know about it the the, the 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 people in power over there they know about it so they're, a, they're in on it so it's a political statement lah. nice it's basically human trafficking they just abandoned the oh, whole nice. building yeah. right the, I, I'm the not cambodian sure about that. yeah it's a huge place dude it's huge it's like a mall size place right i'm not sure about that i've seen a video on it on some instagram news so it's like you can see those bars on every balcony yeah yeah yeah, yeah it's yeah. like an airbnb place where people can live but there's you like can see grills bars, on grills, the yeah. windows and they they just abandoned the whole place after like uh they found it's going to be a raid or something like that mm. they abandoned the whole thing so so imagine you are some dude who is uh just them desperate for money right okay then you see job opportunity come come through your phone it's in Cambodia. The moment you touch down in Cambodia and they meet, okay. you meet up with the people that are supposed to help you out, you know, bring you to your office okay. or whatever, right? Straight away is, oh, you're my, you're my bitch now, right? Wow. Like, like straight away, they have guns and knives and you are their bitch. You are their hostage. So they take you to the scam center and then they set you up. Lah. You're supposed to hit your KPI every day and scam how many people. If not, you're going to get beaten. So, the some of the victims there right they they tried to call the police the police don't even want to respond and then this guy had to say like please i'll pay you i'll I'll transfer you some money or pay you some money come and help us then only the police come and help which is them fucked up bro i'm actually playing quite down why because of the story no because i never knew they actually did that you, you can watch the Al Jazeera documentary Cambodia Cyber Scam. We should go to them and ask them what they think about um, you know the just get them on the podcast. Uh. Just ask about like, <laughs> ask them you know the uh, Macau scammers. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask those hostages. Hey, what do you think about you know the the energy crisis in the US? Yeah. They'll be like, hey, they fuck, fuck you, like, I want to fuck get... you. Like, I need to hit my KPI. Fuck off. <laughs> yeah. But apparently, also there's some people there. Like they sent rescue teams to go there and rescue those people, right? Then they end up working there also. No, <laughs> no, some of them don't want to be rescued because they're earning money. Oh, they're good at scamming oh, lah. Yeah, some, some, of, some of them found their calling lah. Found la. their calling lah. <laughs> I'm a scammer. This is my passion, bro. That's yeah, my passion, bro. Yeah. yeah, some of them don't mind doing that Random shit. Random fist okay. Yeah. Our standards were, yeah. Standards went up, huh? Standards go went down today. Went down today, yeah. Okay, next. The, the, up the, ones, down, the ones that got caught, uh, they caught a 
like a whole bunch of them send them back to China and they came back no send them back to China straight away the firing squad squad brrr, just kill all of them straight wow dude if you're taking people hostage like that what, what punishment should you have this yeah. hot right yeah. there's no other oh, so way wait, so they caught the first who do the scam yeah right? yeah the people that's running and that they shit shot yeah. them la. yeah, yeah. That's, so, that's, fair. that's mercy la. so that's mercy. this that's guy mercy. was telling his story right the moment he went he went into the uh, when, when he met up with the, the kidnappers right the people organizing the scam center within a few days you know because he couldn't do his job or what so the people sold him to another scam, scam organization okay. yeah and then that organization also sold him to another one so it's basically modern day slav- slavery la, dude. Yeah. it is and instead of quite, cotton they're crazy, picking on right? people they're picking on money la. Yeah. Uh. You, you guys see the tinder swindler it's just one dude right basically this girl who it's a got, girl or guy the girl got scammed by a um, guy some guy okay a fake profile okay i think he, he was probably actually a guy la. he's a white guy i think he's a white guy uh, don't know la, but i know this type of shit happens everywhere dude okay I've, i i also heard another case like um recently some some lady um uh, fell in love with someone through a dating app they have not even you smiled a bit when i say fell in love <laughs> loves the mm. scam man. loves the scam dude do you think it's funny that she got scammed no it's funny that she fell in love <laughs> la. yeah. I'm smiling so, yeah, I'm so happy for her <laughs> <laughs> I so, have a good life la. so she never even met the person before and a lot of these scams happen like that they never meet the person before yeah but they willingly transfer over thousands of yeah, money yeah, yeah, yeah. it's love at first first virtual side yeah, oh, yeah. yeah but <laughs> virtual to me, side I, to me I, I just find that very like hey man some people are easy to manipulate love is blind bro. Yeah, yeah, but the, so is money. Does la. love cost that much? For love, some, love like, costs as much as you think it costs. Yeah. yeah, for some people, you can convince them like I'm like you can convince them that oh you, you like me so much, you're gonna help me. Like they will make that into your yeah, yeah, subconscious. Yeah, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah they they brainwash you that Fair like enough. if I'm in trouble, you must help me kind of. Shit. But I think also it's like. Um, the yeah. sweet talk and shit all like ah. they fucking like people are devoid of attention these days right? especially yeah. now everybody's just career 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 then suddenly you get someone blowing up your phone every day yeah. just going I love you you're sweet you're beautiful I love you I'll come meet you all the shit no fall ah so and then they will be like oh my god this guy after a while it just grows on you and you'll be like oh my god every day I wake up this is text yep and you feel like you're, yeah, you feel like that person's your partner already. Ah, even though you haven't meet the person. Yeah, and then you transfer. Over I don't understand how that works. But how of love? Same. Uh, Yo, the scam three just hire men or? What? Which one? They kidnap. Scam, 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 scam men or? Yeah, yeah, just men, not not girls. What? The Cambodia scam, right? Right. Uh, yeah, uh, because, um, I mean, both men and women the... are capable of equal. Scamming. Effort. Yes, scamming. Yes. Uh, but capable. the effort involved is higher for the scam. No, but uh. That's a good question, uh, Harish, and I don't know the answer to that. Like, why they no, actually don't pay half make a note. salary? Yes, yes. I'm going to make a note on my WhatsApp. What note? Uh, what jokes the, are? The Cambodia cyber scam. That's a good, scam. interesting point for me to talk Send about, me. like, or develop. Yeah. yeah. Equality in uh, Cambodia. Yeah, equality. if you want equality, put more women in scamming uh, centers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah 50%. Equality, yeah, that joke will hit, dude. Yeah, 50-50. Yeah. In scamming I'm not, I'm centers. I'm joking, guys. I'm joking, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> At this point, it's okay, dude. No bro, I can't bro. <laughs> the song is coming out. Any fucking, any fucking like I support feminism, women power. Guys, Murtified over here, Tash, Murti. aka Tash. Murti. I no, used no. to be Tash. Now Murti. Murti. Okay, Tash, aka Murtified. Murtified is the Instagram yes. handle. Murtified is what their fans happen. What yes. happened to their fans? What happened? What happened to the fans when they listen to my song? Exactly. I didn't come up with shit. I swear to God. My name is Murti. This, this guy calls me Tash because before, previously I was Tash. I used to call you Tanesh. Tash. Murti. Yes, he used. To, he, see, he didn't even call me Tash. He used to call me Tanesh. Tanganesh, what someone used to call me? What Ben called Tangina. me? Tangina. No, Ben called me Roshan, right? <laughs> the other guy. He's the, he's the Indian guy who came yeah. with the previous episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Tash, just to get the attention of the audience, can you give us a little, like a... Tash me one, a, thing, a, one or two lines, you know? Yeah, 50 bucks. 50 bucks. Oh, 8K up front. 8K up front. We skip that on. Uh, okay, so I can't sing the song in a thing because it's like a legal issues. But uh, it will come out in a month and a half. Then please go check out Murti on Spotify, on Instagram, Murti. Handle Murti. Hey, but what made you famous with legal issues, right? <laughs> what? Le- 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 legal, le- issues. legal issues. Legal issues. <laughs> legal issues. <laughs> legal issues. <laughs> I, can do, I can do the first part. Like, say what you want, do what I want. Got it. 
Cause every time I come around, you play me out, put that song me. Yeah. Uh, that's the start of the song, so you guys can go check it out later on when it comes out. Isn't that amazing, guys? Yeah, singing? It's amazing. No, not singing, but how the fuck is your voice so so strong? What do you call what? Years of Powerful. fucking Powerful. Years of fucking Years singing. of training, right, dude? It's okay, so. Singing and drama, dude. Yeah. See, what? I, trauma. Training and so trauma. So, last time when someone asked me, I'll say trauma. And then now I'm like, it's too cheesy. Right? Why? Is it because, like. Bro, Sing trauma better. Is trauma is from from. Yeah. What's the trauma? Is really? Fuck practice, bro. I want trauma. No, I'm saying like trauma from like your dad just kicking your ass. You can't trauma sing. Package. No, my dad actually doesn't like me singing. Okay. So, wow. my dad actually wanted us to be doctors and lawyers and engineers because I mean, like kind of thing, right? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. But we grew up fucking, like me and my brother grew up fucking just singing under our voice because, um, in the household that we grew up, whenever you sing, the sentence is if you got time to sing, go and study. So, but then we didn't want to study because we like we like singing and we're very creative. More fun, more. Yes, more fun, creative, and all that. So, two seconds. Please. When you said your parents say if you have time to sing, that means you have time to. to why are you doing that, to dude? Study. You're fucking harassing me <laughs> in your own podcast. Bro, Harvey Weinstein. Yeah. Continue, continue. Uh, you said when um your parents say if you have time to sing, that means you can, you have time to study, right? Mm. So what I also trying to say is that you do all the fucking studying for me that I couldn't fucking study. Yes, yes, fair enough, fair enough. That's the more layered version of it, lah. They putting yes. it on you, lah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So yes, exactly that. So basically, what we, uh, what me and my brother was to the family is an insurance plan. So they <laughs> needed us to make it so that they can live happily, right? So that's Indian parents. But we grew up singing because we sang for prayers and all that when we pray at home. So then we got used with the whole singing thing, and then. Over the years, it went from um, prayer songs to like Tamil songs and Tamil songs to R and B, hip hop, that kind of stuff. What about your parents? Do they sing as well? Yes, my dad used to be a singer. <laughs> the irony is, my dad used to be a singer. Wow. Yeah, yeah. So he sang for like functions, and he was very p- politically involved back then with MIC and all that. And then they do shows, and then he had his own cultural charas cultural band thing with all this Bharatanatyam yeah, and yeah. classical singing and all that, right? So yeah. so he's passionate as well. Yeah, he is. But then I mean, life hit him. Then mm-hmm. he decided, you know what? No more. Yep. Pack it. Pack everything up. You know we are poor. We need to fucking you know make money. And my kids are the way I do that. Don't have phones back then. Don't have internet. Yeah. yeah it's not. It's not as easy to. It's like like you were saying just now. No, but he he went up to like RTM and all the stuff. All yeah, yeah, yeah. So he was big there, and something happened to him. I don't know. I haven't spoken to him about it. But one day he just decided to pack everything up, and then just mm. went like, you know what, you guys are studying, and you guys are gonna be academically inclined and all that. But we weren't because we already were in that. You can't just give me fucking a, a toy and then just go like, no, this is a toy is damn fun. You're gonna have so much fun with this. I'm taking this away from you. You can't do that, right? Yeah. And the toy in this case was singing. So we sang whenever we can, and then we kind of grew just singing, singing, singing. I didn't do any training, nothing. So it's just singing in the bathroom, singing whenever nobody's at home. Singing, but singing itself, even in the bathroom, that's training also. It is. It is. Yeah, yeah I, that's, that's a training. Just I like how that. you always post like videos of yourself training in the car, like singing. Yeah, those practice are like session. practice yeah. sections, lah. Yeah, so those are the practice sessions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I'll I won't sing a whole song. I'll just sing like why why say 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 please say. No, because you've already done the singing in the car one, right? You should do another one singing in the bathroom one. Okay, yeah. yeah. record it. I'll send to you only, lah. Oh. You know, the, the, the angle, the it's angle is from your underwear. You know, like right? <laughs> no, no, right under my balls, really. Like. The like yeah, but yeah, censor the balls, lah, because uh, I censor the balls. I'll just show the dick, lah. Yo, your, your choice, dude. Your okay, channel. fair enough. That's fair. Enough. It's my channel. <laughs> it's it's, it's your. It's about. It's about brand awareness. It's, bo- it's body autonomy. Autonomy or something. What is it? What is it? Sure. Male body, body positivity. Ah, male body positivity. What's the podcast? Upshi's one. Uh, the woke up show. Woke yes. Up show. Share this lah. <laughs> <laughs> dude, that's like a challenge. Hey, fucking share this lah. Hey, they will lah. They are very supportive. <laughs> yeah. Next. The they, they are. They are. They are. They are. They are laugh. I'm sorry for the laughter. So they you, are. So you. Ah, dude. So do you like her or not? He has a girlfriend, dude. I d- hey, every time I ask him, you you never say do it. I didn't know you got a girlfriend, dude. Oh, yeah. Who said how, that? How long have you been with that girl? Which girl? Who are you talking about? I don't know. You got a girlfriend? Or? <laughs> oh, me? You? Yeah. 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 Dude, he's looking at you. Yeah, bro. Me. All right. Oh, <laughs> 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 don't squint. <laughs> <don't squint. laughs> he's actually opening his eyes. Oh, he's yeah. Like, he's actually trying to see. No, I said how long you been with your girl? I think two years. Okay, it's quite new. Oh. Past the honeymoon phase. No, bro. They married already. Still banging it out every night. This one I married. Oh. No. Oh no. Oh no. why? Why do you say honeymoon phase? What? No, that's the normal. When someone's like two years, that's the honeymoon phase. Yeah, honeymoon life. phase where it's all. No, just I've like... never had a honeymoon phase with. So you're trying to say like it's always a honeymoon. He's offended, phase. bro. No. Oh. 
Oh, you want that? And he never had a honeymoon. I'm not even. I don't really understand honeymoon per se. Like, what? Oh, you don't understand what's a honeymoon phase? Yeah, what is this honeymoon? Then you have to bring this bring this up before already. <laughs> honeymoon phase like when you all lovey dovey, yeah, you know, and then you just every day. So he never had baby, that. Baby, baby, no, baby. I've had that, but it's not like a phase. It's not like a main thing. Mm-hmm. It was just like you know how like couples they fuck every day for the, the first, first three months. Yeah, three months, and, and then, then it's like once a week for the next two months, and then yeah. once every. Oh, no, two I don't know. And then once every that. year. <laughs> I've never had that. Why you don't know? I don't no, know. it's oh, like do you know fuck every day? I don't know, dude. I I'm not sure about that. Yeah. <laughs> do not have experience <laughs> in that matter. I'm quite an ex- inexperienced yeah. in that sector. I've never had the honeymoon phase. You never had the honeymoon phase? What was yours? BDSM was just... BDSM phase. <laughs> BDSM right? <laughs> no, I think more realization. Was it. it was trauma. Realization oh. of what? Why I like this girl? <laughs> t- about... How long do you think for you to realize you like her? Not Just long. Twenty minutes. No. First sight, ah. No, it wasn't first sight. Second sight, lah. Took me like two months, three months. Okay. So what had to fall? What had to fall into place for you to realize? Her? She makes me laugh, lah. Okay. Do you make her laugh? No. She okay. doesn't laugh she's at funnier. all my jokes. She's way funnier. She's funnier because she da- she's she's Malay, so and she. So Indonesian, ah. Huh? And she can do like no, she's he he no no. What what I meant by that was, he um BM and Tamil is not his forte. But he can he can speak, but it's not his forte. She, yeah. BM, she's Malay, right? Yeah. And then she speaks English, and then she can do mimicry, voice mimicries, and all the stuff for. Her. And then she her idea is always out of the box kind of thing. Yeah. So she says she's random ready. stuff. Yeah. She'll say random stuff, yeah, yeah. and then it'll be funny for some reason. I know some people are like that. Dude. Ah, so that's why he kind of likes her. My comedy is very structured, and hers is not structured. It's just it's whatever cool. comes. Yeah, it's, it's something, something like, like Ben like or Ben's watch. like that. Who's Ben? Benjamin. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah like him. Yeah. By the way, fuck Ashraf, huh? Yeah, fuck Ashraf. Yeah, you hey, know who's a fuck Arul, eh? Welcome, Ashraf. Yeah, whatever you say. Welcome, Ashraf. Is Arul the buffest comic, or? No. No, Ashraf dude. is. You, dude. You, dude. Hey, I'm not a comic, bro. Wow. Yeah. But, okay. yeah, but Arul. Ash- Arul is the... Yeah, buffest, is, la. Yeah, I mean... No, I think Papi Zag is, lah. Papi, uh, <laughs> yeah. He is, though. He's huge. Arul is so buff, dude. He's do, do, you think, do you think he's fat, or do you think that's his body? Uh, I think there's a fat percentage, but most of his muscle, bro. Yeah, I, I mean yeah. that could be. Oh, does he? Does you he look at his arms, arms, bro. No, no, yeah, Yo, but you're right. He just he is built. He's built, bro. Yeah. Fucking yeah. big, bro. He's, he's interesting now. Yeah, bro. He's Fiji. See, right? this is the part where I cannot believe any of you. No, he's professional. Oh, he's go, go to his profile. Also, he was the Mr. Potato guy. Hey, fuck you all. Go to his right. profile. No, he was. He was the See, Mr. Potato the, guy. This is the thing about Indians. They're always lying. Fucking racist. Oh. Correct, lah. Correct, but fucking racist. Anyway, no, but go to the profile. True. No, he was the Mr. Potato guy, right? Yeah, he, he got fired, right? Not fired. No, he ate all the chips. That's why. He ate all the chips. Yeah. <laughs> that's why when you buy Mr. Potato, it's half the can. Papi Zack ate Papi Zack takes his percentage. Papi Zack, yeah. Papi Zack takes royalty when Papi Zack won. Dude, I went for a pot- Mr. Potato casting uh, audition before. They cancelled, right? Because Papi Zack was there. No, basic- <laughs> <laughs> no, basically, I couldn't eat the chips as, as nice as they wanted me to eat it, huh? Why? Because yeah. they wanted to be like, no. Yeah, yeah. They were wow. telling me. So you do like. I can feel my hair dropping. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I couldn't. You know how Papi said got the role for. What he ate the camera? For he, he Mr. Pareto. Yeah. When they were having the he audition, right? He just came to watch, dude. Everyone's <laughs> <laughs> was like, are you here for the audition? No, I'm here for the chips. Like, You're hired. Yeah, hired. Okay, like, hey guys, I'm going to pee you. What's the pee you? No, they just throw the hat at him. It just landed oh, on him. Fuck, dude. I want to pee so badly. Why you ask like as if you want to follow you pee at the same time? This is the outtakes, man. This is the outtakes, man. Sure, bro. Acting is tough, man. <laughs> no, Brian asked, like, Hey, uh, what? I want to pee. Who wants to pee? Do I think Where? Brian, what? I think... Hey, I think, hey, hey come. Is Brian, the same bowl. is Brian straight? Yeah. Brian's gay, right? No, he's not. He's hey, not look, bi, yeah? LGBT power, man. He's no not bi, though. Because he was touching me, dude. He was touching know, me. He's, he's never seen him with a guy. Always the girl. So it's okay. He's with he's three guys right now, dude. Uh, no, I've never seen him. I've never seen him going after a guy. So yeah. He actually went after three of us. That's uh, how he. Yeah. He picked us up, dude. He picked us up. All of us asked him the same question before: Are you gay? Are you gay? Then he's like, oh. I think like I think everybody here has given out uh, like gay vibes. Gay vibes. Yo, you know what he thought? He thought me and Rizman are gay. I thought he, the first I saw, I thought they were. 
That's yeah, what Kavin cool. asked me, dude. No, like, they were. When you guys Kav- were too fucking close. Kavin asked who? No, Kavin. The first time Kavin knew that I was a virgin, Kavin was like, "Are you gay?" That's the first thing he asked me. Mm. What's the first thing Kiran asked you? Kiran's like, "Fuck you, lah." That's the first thing he told you. I I, I don't know. That's why I assumed he said lah. That was the first thing Kiran like told me. Huh? That was the first thing Kiran told me. Because back then I had afro and uh. crazy hair. Back then. He was like, hey, your barber died. <laughs> nice. Who asked you that? Kiran, Kiran. The first thing he asked me. This was like 2014. Was that before or after he arrested you? This is way before. When I was... I was the... I was the usher of the scene like, back then. Ah. Yeah, when I was hot. Yeah. I like, like how I'm like... Uh, uh, reference. The usher really looks like the Sally. Sally. Like the what? Sally. Who is Sally? Sally from the... Oh, Sally. Oh, Sally. Uh, oh, Sally from yeah. Monsters. Can you do the voice? Huh? Can you do the voice? You know, I cannot do animation now. <laughs> Just do your face like this, dude. <laughs> Isn't that how your face is? Yeah, that's how your face is. Normally, I can do the you know the lady agent agent zero, the one the one in the counter. The asshole, lah. Uh. Ah, uh, the one that will the slimy girl. Uh, yeah. With glasses. Mike Wazowski. Mike. Yeah. We found. <laughs> You We're anything. letting you go. <coughs> hey, do you all watch? Do you all watch Kung Fu Hustle? Yeah, dude, it's the best. What kind of I'm, 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 I haven't watched it for ten years. Uh, at least ten years. That and fucking Shaolin Soccer, bro. Yeah, I, 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 oh, I'm gonna rewatch Shaolin Soccer. Stephen again. Chow is my favorite. One of my dude, favorite comedians. So... Is it true that Stephen Chow pra- practiced uh, football for one year to take the role as Shaolin Soccer? <laughs> Like, no, it's fucking. You fucking <laughs> dude, but it's quite similar. Oh, are you guys fans of uh, Austin Powers? Um, I mean, uh, I like the actor, la. Mike. Not the movie. I'm, I'm, oh, you, you you don't think that? Like, what's like his name? Powers Mike what? Mike Myers. Story, right? Mike, yeah. Mike Myers, right? Yeah, Mike. No, Mike Myers is the murderer, right? It's yeah, it's very similar, right? Stephen uh, Chow, but he uses the same actors. So what's the, what's his Austin Powers name? Real name? Mike, Mike Myers. Myers. Mike Myers. Shrek, la. Mike Myers is Shrek. I like the yoga. What's the yoga movie? Love Guru. Love Guru. Huh? Was it Love Guru? Yoga movie. Love Guru was Mike Myers, right? Oh, you're talking... No, Adam Sandler. Love Guru. Yeah. Was Harish lah? No, that's Zohan. That's <laughs> Zohan no. is Adam Sandler. Love Guru. Zohan is I I hated Zohan. Zohan. Love Guru. No idea. I thought Zohan was Chris 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 Gary also nuts. Nah. No, Love Guru no. was Love Guru exploded back then. I forgot. Yeah, I forgot who did Love Guru. I think it's yeah, it was Mike Myers. Like yeah. Do you have to watch Love Guru? It's a It's a very good movie. Classic. Like. With Jessica I, Alba in it. Oh, okay. I, I go watch now. I go watch now. Yeah. yeah. Okay, fine. So just, you should have just said Jessica Alba. Okay, guys. She's cute. La. She was cute. Favorite, Bro, favorite. cute is not the word you'll use to... No, trust me. I like cute girls more than... than pretty. He said he cannot trust you. Yeah, he said he cannot trust you. Okay. What? He said he cannot trust you. I prefer cute. So you trust so me or I trust Akshay? Yeah, huh? tra- what? What? I trust Akshay. You trust Ashraf now, bro. You because need to make up your because mind. Because I bro. prefer cute over hot. Nice yes, one. Uh, I prefer cute and hot, lah. Why not have? Both so every, no one likes hot here. Lah. Everyone likes cute. Like yeah, I like cute. Hot. But like, if you had to choose one, cute. Why the fuck you bring limits to what a girl should be? Like, just no, 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 it's, it's our game. preference. Yeah. Our preference. It's just a game, lah. It's just a game, bro. Uh, ah, yeah, cute, lah. Cute, lah. Hundred percent cute, lah. Cute, lah. Cute, lah. I like innocent looking, lah. Cute, lah. Cute. That's cute, lah. Yeah, yeah. It is. Only time they're gonna think. Like like Hinata from now. Yes. Ah, <laughs> but she hot though. That, 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 no, that's the <laughs> reference. That's the reference, lah. Hinata, Hinata. Sakura, but honestly, Sakura not innocent. Because she's trash, right? She's a whole. Yeah. She's Do you a know? Hoe. Yeah, she's fucking. She whole. She used Naruto for fucking five hundred episodes. Yeah. Fuck that. Bitch. Do you know? Hey, did she end up with Naruto? No. no. Who did she end up with? Sa- Sasuke. Sasuke. Fuck. Yeah. Sasuke is cooler though. Of course yeah, lah, yeah, of yeah, course yeah. lah. King dramatic childhood. Ooh, I lost my whole clan. Fuck you. No, but honestly, okay, I, I fuck you lah. Fuck you lah. Who died? I lost my leg again. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I ain't digging uh, Hitnata though. Huh? Just ain't my style, man. The oh, grown up one, the young one. <laughs> oh, grown up one is a little better, but Sakura is still better though. Sakura. Ino, Ino. Ino, oh, Ino is is hot. Is hot. Ino again. I forgot. Ino, Ino, fucking mind transfer shit. Uh, Rock Lee's good good one, right? Ah yeah, yeah, yeah. Rockless group yeah, she's you know, hot. Yeah, she's hot lah. Hot, she's hot. hot no lah, she's not Rockless group. She is uh, from. Oh, Shikamaru. You know Shikamaru. Shikamaru. You know Shikamaru. Rockless one is Ten Ten. She's hot also. Ah, Ten Ten is. Ten Ten is hot weapons. also. Yeah, she's but she's Ten Ten. Uh, not my style. No, she's nobody style. She was a filler episode. <laughs> she's a filler. She's a filler character. <laughs> she's a filler episode. <laughs> Every time it comes to her, it's like five minutes. Ciao. What? I don't watch Naruto, so I don't know. Anything. Okay, keep talking about Naruto then. 
Do you, do you play King of Fighters? <laughs> Nobody. I already know. Re- uh, oh, <laughs> I wanted to see Ryu and Ken. That's uh, Street, Street Fighter. Fighter yeah. Yeah. King of I didn't know a Terry. Oh, Pets. Oh, Terry Bogart. Uh, this yeah, that's what you want to know. I, I watched the series a bit, man. It was damn good, man. Who was Wonder Pets here? Bro, the duckling. What the fuck is Wonder Pets? The fuck? Apa yang pasal? Cyber Cops. Kerja sama. Cyber Cops. Cyber Cops. Cyber Cops. Yes. Dragon, dragon. That's a tumbuka halilintar share. You watch English one. Dragon Booster. No man. Which I watched BM one. Dude, did you watch Dragon Booster? Astro Cheerio. 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 So what is the rationale behind not wanting to listen to a language you know? What's come again? Sorry. <laughs> what is the rationale be- behind listening to a language that you don't understand? I don't know because it frees your brain. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. For me, for yeah, me, yeah. if I watch like Chinese like Mandarin movies or what Chinese movies, I'll watch it. But for me, it's like when they're talking, I'm like, oh, I, I think they're gonna do that. I think they're gonna do this. Let me understand that kind of thing, right? But I don't know what the fuck they, they can be talking about cooking. I'll be like, they're gonna murder the floor. Right? And here's the best part: it's not even. When you're watching a movie that's how to tell in a foreign language, you're actually looking at most of it is the body language. Yeah. Yeah. And good actors have great body language on set. Mm. Yes, fair enough. So which comes back to Kung Fu as well, so lah. Kung Fu is nothing but body language, bro. Yeah. yeah. Oh. It's Kung Fu, bro. You know the 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 part at the start where the the fat friend sits on the chair and just. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That was. I, Gangsters, yeah. It's fucking hilarious back then. Now it's still hilarious to me, yeah. dude. For you to do to put slapstick shit into your comedy film and have high ratings, right? Like I'm going. Dude, by, and the animation was mad at that point. They they purposely made it shit. Yeah. They purposely made it shit. Yeah. The the fight the fight back. I mean the the what do you call it? Uh, the fight choreography yeah. is still quite. It's still quite good yeah, right bro, now. Bro, yeah. It's still quite good. The, right the, now. the one he will step on the leg one. Oh. But the one he will step on the leg one. Yeah. Yeah. Prrr, oh. <laughs> Mad though they made it look like damn cheesy like you know, that, but it's you know fun. Which, you know which part hit me uh hard where it, it didn't hit me this hard when I was younger. The part where he tried to rob the mute girl in the present. Ah, uh, bro, I understood that more like when I'm adult. Yeah, dude, I watched it yeah last night, dude. I just I teared a bit, man. You didn't watch Kung Fu, sir? She watched Shaolin Soccer. Shaolin Soccer. Soccer. Shaolin Soccer. You know what? Which part I like? The one at the final match there yeah. when that guy will kick at the keeper, the keeper will save, and then he keep kicking at the keeper. I'd be like, what the fuck is the team doing? What are you like? Okay, the keeper got it. Like, we just stand here and watch, like, fuck it, lah. Like. <laughs> and the keeper die, bro. One point he just got oh, the, the Bruce just, Lee. Ah, yeah. and he were bunkos. I don't remember. Mean like the whole scene will be like three minutes. The team just be like, yeah, got got tethered there. They'll bring him with the stretcher. You ah, know, the game they got still time going to go there. They got time to come and help him after that. But put that. The whole kick, kick, go tackle him, lah. But the thing, it wasn't about logic. It was about the fact that kung fu is strong, the kind of thing, the iron hey, belly and all that. It's just like kung fu hustle, you brother. Know? Kung fu hustle. Remember at the, at the start when the 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 three kung fu people from the village, ah. right? They wanna they they so one guy comes out first, right? And when everyone attacks him, right? I was like, is I, can there's like a hundred people attacking him at once, but no one managed to hit him yeah. even once because he's kung strong, fu, dude. He's kung fu too strong, lah. He's la. the toad, the toad master, lah. The to- what the kung fu hustle one? The, the bad that guy. old guy lah, the to- toad buster lah. To- what a character, right? Yeah, yeah, dude, yeah, his whole whole power is about like the toad fucker grow lah, what a fucker. It was random. She was entertaining for us, like, I guess. It was nice. Yeah, it was nice. It was very nice. Yeah. You watch any Tamil movies? Sorry. Do you watch any Tamil movies? You racist oh, bastard. Yeah, just, I knew it. Yeah. Watch Parai Panna. No, no, bro. I I only watch Samdok Milan. Does that count as Tamil? No, no dude. That's, that's the Hindi. worst fucking. That's Hindi. That's that's Hindi. English. English. Sixty percent English. Yeah. Bro. It's Hollywood Hindi. Yeah, it's Hollywood. Oh, Hindi. it's Hindi. Oh, okay, okay. Wait, it's Disney, about... dude. Yeah. It's Hindi wood. Yeah. So you're talking about Tamil uh, action comedies. Disney wood. Ta- what's that coming in? The, are you trying to talk about uh, Tamil action comedies? Dude, Tamil and action, same thing. Every movie will have action. I remember, if yeah. Tamil movie no action, it's, it's not Tamil. Uh, movie. The Indian most movie, depressed, Indian movie, yes. the most depressed, saddest Indian movie. We'll have one plus punching fifty plus. If no one punches, that's not a movie. That's not a movie. We are still waiting for. They cannot release that movie. They can't. Release. <laughs> they cannot release yeah. that. The movie, movie can be three hours. <laughs> cannot release lah. Yeah. Cancel, cancel. No, no one punches. Also, Peter's bit about them singing for six hours. That's all. Uh, that's it's, Bollywood. Bollywood. No, that's the practice session. Suppose <laughs> yeah. But is it like that? Like, is the movies really damn long? Yeah, yeah three hours, movies, like three hours, two and a half so hours. So I know the like, rings, sir, but no signal. Yeah, yeah, right. but
Tamil like Hindi movies make their songs. This is where they'll go and uh, dance lah. On the screen there. Eh? I know you guys can't see but that's so, where they dance lah. Yeah, so only that's the, the difference between Tamil movie and uh, Hollywood movie. Ho- other white Hollywood. movies. <laughs> uh, Hollywood movies. Uh, like what well, Hollywood movies I think now they use uh, the green screen to uh, even like yeah. to create a whole different space. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but Tamil movies they actually, actually go there. They go there. You know what's the green screen? Switzerland. Green but not really Switzerland. No, actually, they go to Switzerland okay. for yeah. a song. They'll go to yeah. fucking Denmark and dance. Why do you think they do that instead of just use because green screen? Because they're Indians, dude. No, because it's. Well, isn't the budget the even more? If you the, no, back then I think it was more expensive to do 3D than yeah, 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 fly yeah. and go. Yeah, CGI is them yeah. actually. Yeah, now it's more accessible. It's. How's the CGI in Tamil movies? Now it's worse, lah. Why? I think it's worse. It's worse. It's because worse now. The okay the. How to say? Uh, if you sit down Avengers movies or like all these Western movies, yeah, the comparison the, is you shit. You see the you see the credit se- credit section. Most of them are Indians. Most of them are Indians, and they went to fucking. Ah, uh, they Hollywood. rather work for another yes. industry than their own of home course. industry because it's they don't up. pay well. Yeah, it's messed up, and also like the standards are like I guess damn low because they're fucking. It's damn shit. The animation is damn shit. The other day I watched this movie about this Tamil movie about these creatures. It was actually. a remake of a hollywood movie that just came out chris pratt acts in it so what's, what's the hollywood movie called i forgot but it's like the war of tomorrow or something oh yeah tomorrow's war ah uh, tomorrow's war the mm-hmm. aliens you know got these creatures in inverse is the same thing the creature like the move the human movement is faster than the creature's movement yet somehow they can't shoot the thing <laughs> how, the animation is so bad that they can't actually animate it to be that fast because frame rates or what the fuck so they are moving faster than the creature but the creature escapes and the creature looks like a one tone fucking plasticine model music and everything or like in hollywood singers become famous because they make songs of their own right yeah. in india they become yeah, yeah, famous yeah. because of movie songs yeah yeah they became artists of yes that. they are they are recording artists for movies they're not artists on their own yeah. they go and sing live and everything but they won't have a song of their own that it came out because of shankar mahadevan did the song maybe god lah but the majority now is it's very rare now god, six around has lah Like yeah, back then, Bala. like yeah, yeah, singers like Ashwin Bala, his album is five songs in a movie. Yes, That's an album. his songs all movie songs. The album is the movie. Yeah. That's the yeah. Yesu Gasto. Yeah, the OST. Yes, no, all OST, no, all OST. So the the culture is carried forward now. So now, so in Malaysia, you see right, like um, Indian players making their own music, yeah. and then you'll have like artists who are just doing OSTs for like Astro shows, um, movie production. But they now because production is more accessible to everybody, people can make their own music lah. But back then in in India, let's say in India, it was just movie, 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 movie. I think Indians came to Malaysia and started making like Daki and all that. I think Malaysian Indians started making own record stuff for like back then we had Lock Up, the Keys, Daki, who else? Nachatra. Na- Yogi, ah, Yogi, Yogi B. B. Nachatra. Uh, Yogi B. became so big. Psycho Man. Hey, like, who's okay? Who's the who is the Leonardo DiCaprio of Indian Indian? Leonardo movies? DiCaprio of Indian movies, ah. Uh. Vijay Sethupathi, ah. Uh. Sorry, what? Who is the Leo, Leo DiCaprio? Leo. Um, in movies. Brad Pitt, ah, Brad Pitt, ah, same thing. No, Brad Pitt has to be Vijay. Yeah, Bro, they... Vikram, maybe Vikram. <laughs> sort of, lah. Vikram, okay. I, I, Vikram, I, I, yeah, I can agree. Yeah, Vikram. The yeah. current crop, the best right now is Vijay Sethupathi. Danush is pretty dope. Yeah, he acted in one American movie also. And that one is nice, American nice. movies thing. Oh, there's no essence to his the to gray, his acting. The gray, yeah. He didn't have to act as hard as how he acted in Marian. Yeah, that one is just high pretty. Oh sorry. Yeah, you're hosting, bro. <laughs> But yeah, I haven't been like keeping up with the Tamil movie scene. The Tamil movie scene at all. Bro, it's nothing to keep up. <laughs> you watch a story from 2008, you watch a story now. The only difference is now there's more layers, less fighting, nicer music like now age music because it's Ram Singh's half the songs. No, but there are some movies like the ones my brothers because I only know Tamil movies now when my brothers get tickets to watch and the That's movies the most of the movies i watch now do the everything is gotten better yeah if you watch vijay sethupathi movies or yeah. comedy movies like this movie called bose ingira baskaran yeah. the whole movie is a fucking comedy movie yeah. the storyline is them fun it's a it's a fun family kind of movie but the jokes are dark as fuck roasty and the shit all okay they excel in that kind of thing but if you want to go watch like a serious movie it'll be vijay or either fucking surya or another person uh, now no dude that's not serious like serious is vikram no 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 i'm not talking movie. about that is you want action movies serious. right no no action movies yeah yeah no 
Yes, don't go. Action movies, don't go. Because it'll be Vijay jumping from building to building. A normal human being. Yeah, yeah. Jumping from building to building, Assassin's Creed style. Beating up 70 people to save one girl in a train. That kind of random stupid bullshit. Is that not nice? No, but... No, it's fun. It's, it's fun, fun to watch I like watch. on Deepavali. La. Yes, I watch. Because it's like, oh, fighting and all uh, that. Like The Rock. La. Like The Rock. Is ah, like, like, like you watch fast. Like... Okay, Indian movies are now Fast and Furious. La. Yeah, bro, Fast ah. and Furious is quite ridiculous. Yes, exactly. Those are Indian movies. Like yeah, yeah I, I mean, the... I think I forgot it's like Fast 5 or Fast 6. Mm-hmm. Huh? He just jumped and punched the helicopter in the sky. Yeah. Dwayne Johnson, when I saw that. Oh, that was uh, a Hobbs, Hobbs, and, and Hobbs and Shaw. No, no, no. Before that also. Oh, yes. Uh, Hobbs and Shaw was a lot of the cliff. The, oh, the Mustang. Uh. I, I can't remember, but it was before that. Uh. I think he just jumped up and he punched the helicopter. Oh, I don't remember. That was a tribute for... What? And how did he get Mr. there? Uh? Like, they were just... Okay, uh, what Brian is just an ex cop, just a normal undercover ex cop. Okay, yeah, everyone, NBA, had, dude. everyone had no powers back then, and then suddenly, as the franchise went on, and suddenly can fly. Yeah, they suddenly almost... no, they are like the elite of the elite top agents or what, trying to save the world. No, the next one, they're gonna fight Godzilla, hundred percent. Yeah, gonna <laughs> uh, fight Godzilla. Fast franchise is under what? Columbia. Uh, Universal, I think. Universal. Universal. Yeah. Universal. I think so. Yeah, it is. Under- okay, yeah, hey guys, Universal. favorite. Favorite comedies. Favorite com- yeah, comedy you... or comedian? Okay, comedies. Fine. Okay, fine. Movie. Co- comedic, uh, comedic actors. Comedic actors. Uh, yeah. oh, Lord, English or English? English. Yeah. English uh. I don't know. Will Ferrell was nice back then. Long. Okay, Will Ferrell was good. Um, Adam Sandler mine is still dope. Seth Rogen. Seth Rogen, seriously. Nice. Yeah, mine is Seth He's Rogen. nice. Pineapple Express was one, one of my favorite movies. That's fucking Did you watch House Bunny? Yeah, Anna Ferris, right? Oh, I love her, dude. But is it funny? <laughs> I watch it because of her. Dude. Yeah, she's like she's like my childhood crush. O- okay, yeah. Uh, then fav- um favorite Hollywood actress. Actress, uh? yeah. I don't know. Do I like them because yeah. some of them are cute? Yeah, yeah. doesn't no doesn't yes. I mean fine. Who you think is the hottest? Uh, doesn't Charlie Theron, Halle Berry. Charlie Theron, yes. Halle Berry, oh, yes. Charlie Theron. Um, mine is probably like Zoe Deschanel. Oh, oh uh, do you have a Katy Perry? Do you have a Katy Perry fixation? I, dude, do you all not like Katy Perry? Is Katy Perry not She's a good girl. She's a, <laughs> she's a good girl. What? She's a what? She's a good girl. She kissed a girl and she liked it. Yeah. Uh, what do you think of Anna Diarmas? I don't know who's that. Fair enough. Is it the quite cute, right? Well, Anna Diarmas is the one in. She's the Bond girl. Yes. And she acted in Sun. Grey Man. Not in Grey Man. Uh, Blade Runner. Oh no! Yeah, I didn't watch that. Yeah. Oh damn. Um, this one. Who's the Spider-Man girl? Emma Watson. Uh, Emma Watson. What do you think, Emma? Emma Watson. Emma Stone. Emma Stone. It's Emma not Watson. Emma Watson. Emma Stone. Emma, <laughs> Emma Watson. Hermione. Hermione. Um, Emma Stone. No idea. Emma Stone. Stone. No, no, I know her. I know her. But oh, okay. Emma Watson. What's that girl's name? Are from uh the Wolf on Wall Street? Oh, Margaret Robbie. Yeah, holy shit. Margaret Robbie. For me, that is one of that. That is my definition of hot. Uh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. You know the girl from Spy. That's a lot of people's definition of hot. Yeah. The girl from Spy. Why? Spy. The one with Jason Statham and that big chubby girl. Oh, uh, Anne, Anne Hathaway. Hathaway. Oh? No, the big it's chubby girl. Rebel Wilson. Uh. The big Rebel chubby... Wilson. Is that her? I think so. Oh, Rebel no, 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 not Rebel Wilson. Like not Rebel Wilson. Wilson. Uh, Rebel something lah. Rebel Wilson is the one in Pitch Perfect. Yeah. Okay, who's from Spy? Spy is the no, other one, the older one. one. She's more funnier. The one with, uh, more what's that? The one who came in the uh, female Ghostbusters, the one. Uh. Ah, ah, yes. The one. What's her name? 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 That is girl lah. This lady. Um, Lisa McCarthy. Ah, she's Melissa so McCarthy. hot. Lisa McCarthy is what, hot. Show me, show me. Oh damn! Hold on, one To me, she's Sorry, hot. Open Do you all watch the uh, Top Gun? No. The new one? Yeah. No, but everybody was like, "Oh, so good, so good." Bro, I I couldn't. That's her, Melissa McCarthy. I couldn't take pop. You, none of you oh, watch R- Top Gun. Rose Bryan is oh, also. Why, huh? Rose Bryan is Doesn't cute. Doesn't appeal to Indians. Damn And Jude Law is to me one of the most. Man, right. First class. Jude Law is. Jude Law went from being everybody's every girl's yeah. wet dream to the point they're like, oh, of course Jude Law. They can't even like they can't even believe it anymore. Jude, Jude Law is so good think looking. He's hey, Jude Law, I don't think he's. I don't think he's like, good looking. Oh, nineties. Yeah, very good looking. Yeah. Yeah. Like late nineties. Watson. Watson. Yes. Oh, okay, he's peak then, uh, dude. Matt. Matt, good looking. I mean, to me, the uh, who's good looking like guy uh, uh. right? Is just Chris Evans. Uh, for me, for me, it's George Clooney, dude. For me, it's George Clooney. The Clooney only can't touch la. Like it's like saying Denzel. Yeah, Bobby, like, he's Bradley like la. Yo, Piers Brosnan now. Oh, now? Now? Yeah. You got oh, crushed. Fuck, dude. What about Vin Diesel? <laughs> <laughs> I like him better as Groot la, dude. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
so stupid. Like I think Hrithik Roshan uh, handsomeness is unbeatable. He's it's like stupid. out of this world. It's out of ah, this world. Ah, the cuts are stupid. His sharp fucking He's goblin too... face. So stupid. He must uh, play too unreal. Kill Bang hey, Mary. Let's just do a Kill Bang Mary. What the fuck? Oh, kill, oh, bang, kill bang, Mary. bang Mary. Kill fuck Mary lah. Okay. <laughs> Say it Chinese. Kill oh, Bang Mary. Kill Bang Mary. Yeah. Kill Bang Mary. <laughs> Guys, we're not racist. We're just making having. So, so you pick the name. And then we just say kill no, no. bang off. Fuck is it? No no no. We we also just names and then we we do kill bang Mary. Oh, I'm gonna Shit. suck at this. Okay, go continue. Uh, Malaysian. Malaysian. Yeah, Malaysian can be any anyone. Just a celebrity. Okay. 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 Guys. <laughs> okay, continue. Uh, oh, this one all guys. Uh. Just put Genie Boy. Uh. Yeah. I don't know Genie Boy. Boy. Yeah, I don't know Genie Boy. Boy. I don't know. Genie Boy. Genie TV lah. You don't know him personally or don't know him as a person. I've never seen. How is it? I don't know. Chinese guy. Stephen Chow. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Oh, don't okay. compare him. <laughs> He's a good guy, lah. He's, g- okay, He's good. He's good. Okay, yeah, this boy is good. Okay, simple, lah. Stephen Chow, uh, Jackie Chan, Bruce Lee. Uh, kill Bang Mary. <laughs> yeah, Kill Bang Mary. Stephen Chow, Jackie Chan, Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. Uh, or you want Donnie and kill Bruce Lee? Cause he's dying anyway, so he's dead, ah, bro. He's dead. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> he's, I mean, Lee. like at this point, lah. Okay. Bang Jackie Chan because he's gonna die anyway. Give him one last ride, lah. One last ride. One last ride for family. I think Jackie Chan's like the Mary type, you know, just like his movies yeah. are all family oriented. Yeah. You know? And then he's like Goku. I love Stephen Chow because he can make me laugh. <laughs> Stephen Chow's the bang type for me, you know. Yes, sir. Yeah, because I think he's quite hot in Kung Fu. So the fuck. Yeah. Um. I stop for a while. I stop for. I say it for you. Can we uh do female instead? Just <laughs> <laughs> do like I no, said. So the, I said that Chan- he kill Bang Mary. Okay, so for me it'll be kill Bruce Lee hundred yeah. percent. Mary either okay. Fuck Jackie Chan lah, cause he's just he's an icon, and then Mary Stephen Chow lah. Why? Cause he's good at. No, cause he's the only one remaining. Okay. I kill both. I kill one fuck one already. Yeah. Mary the one lah. You Harish. You Harish. Wait, who's the people again? Gigi. Jackie Chan, Bruce Lee, Stephen, Stephen Chow. Chow. Kill fuck Mary. Oh, I'll marry Bruce Lee. Why? Because he teach you how to fight. Insurance money, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Fair. Fair. Insurance money. You don't even need to give him the disease. Nobody knows what disease. Perfect insurance money claim. Yeah. But then insurance will say, oh, it's an undocumented disease. We cannot pay you. He's an actor, bro. Very sorry. Yeah. I need to... Mary, at least you can tell why he died. I really want a box. You want a box? Liar. Liar. Can you want to box? Tell him, yeah. dude. Okay, boxer. Tell him, bro. Dude, can you call him? Dude, I will. I'll do boxing with you anytime, dude. Yeah, serious. How Anyone? much do I pay? Anybody got gay vibes from that? Huh? It is. Slightly? We already we already talking, talking about fucking. I will just yeah. Yeah. here. Yeah, sure. You I have pets a... and everything. What? Oh shit! Like one on one. Yeah. Dude, that'll be damn tough. Yeah. Thirty bucks. So when's the wedding? <laughs> For one hour. Uh, no, no, free lah, bro. Fuck, don't need to. Joking. Yeah. Oh, okay, cause dude, I'm really up already. Yeah, sure, man. That's what everyone says, lah. But then after one one session, they're like, "That's not dude, really for me." <laughs> no, fuck that shit, dude. I really need this. Yeah, it's good, it, bro. I tell you, it's the most fun form of exercising boxing. Yeah. And what's more fun than that is hitting the bag because you don't need a partner. I hit the bag, bro. I hit the bag, right? I I kid you not. When I when I do it, when I start and finish, which is only forty five minutes of, uh, including warm up one hour, right? I lose two kgs of. I sweat two kgs. Of course, you hydrate back, lah. But you sweat two kgs. Just man, in one hour. Water lah. A lot of water. A lot of water. Yeah. water but that's yeah. how much you sweat, dude. Just man. And yeah. and the reason and like compared to me running, I can run and I kill myself, right? I need uh sweat fun out food. one one kg because you don't think about it when you're having fun, right? Yeah, yeah, fair when enough. You're, when fair you're enough. boxing, yeah. And plus, it's stress release also. Yeah. It's all so that. Safe that's violence, the best yeah. part. Yeah. 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 What days are you? Every free? day, I do it every day. Every day. Just can I start? Can I start once hustle, a week first? Hustle, bro. Bro, you can do whatever, man. Yeah. Don't, just don't hug the bag, lah. Don't try to have a bundle in the bag. He punch a bit. Sorry, pain, lah. Sorry, okay, dude. Hey, come, like. Yeah. Fuck, Mary kill. Stephen Chow, Jackie Chan, Bruce fucking Lee. Oh, Mary Jackie Chan, 100%. Fair enough. Because he's good with family, you know? <laughs> he's family good with man. He's family oriented, family you know? Family man, yeah. Uh, he doesn't give money to kids. Fuck Stephen Chow because he's sexy AF. Okay. Yeah. And okay, I kill Bruce Lee. Yeah, because he's dead already. Yeah, Wait, man. you? What, what? What was yours? Mine was kill Bruce Lee. Fuck Jackie Chan, Mary Stephen Chow. Okay, let's do girls now. All right, here we go. Arish, you're going to be excited, right? Now we, now we can be natural. Hey, sh- hey sh- dude. Now we can be open. What do you think? What if we do girls? Now I can be straight, dude. <laughs> can be straight. What if we do girls like notable names? You think that would, people will get offended by that? No? no, I mean like it's a game. Come on, guys. What the fuck? You can do the same as us. So not not that you want to fuck with. Wait, what's a, a, like three names that both? What, sorry? Three uh, names? Three names, sorry. Three girls. 
Can I say uh, Elizabeth Tan? Okay, Sajad lah. Sajad is one. Lah. Sajad, Ken? No, 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 no. Sajad. Sajad Ken lah. Oh, haram ah. I can yeah. kill her lah. <laughs> yeah, I can just kill what. So, okay. uh, no, no, no. So Sajad. Who is this hot Malaysian girl? Elizabeth Tan lah. Elizabeth Tan. I don't know okay. Elizabeth Tan. Hey, her audience is mostly Malay, right? Mad, bro. Yeah, they fucking oh, love. And she me plays. Me Nana, hey, do you like Nana Ahalek? Who the fuck is Nana? Okay, wait. Elizabeth hey, Tan okay. is what is she? Is she a oh, she's singer? Chinese. She's just a hot girl, dude. <laughs> she probably can sing lah. Just she's singer. Auto tune la. everything, singer. then sing only. Yeah. She's a good singer, dude. Wait, are you serious? No. <laughs> <laughs> Elizabeth Tan. Yeah. Puyi also Miss Puyi also got a song, dude. She's also singer now. Oh. Yeah. DJ also so just take a picture behind the turntable. <laughs> that, is that who is that? Elizabeth Tan? Yeah. Is that Lizzie? Oh, Nana or Halik? Wait, that's my favorite. Moving from like a motivational podcast. Yeah. The next podcast Bro, episode. Let me let me get this straight lah. Non- nothing was motivational in this whole podcast. Yes. Even that part where it seemed like it is just not lah. You know why? Why? Oh, she's married, dude. Because it's us. What? She's married. She's married. Yeah. Oh shit. She's married. Oh, oh fuck. No, but we have to pretend she's not married. And she will also uh, pretend. No, no, no. It doesn't not matter. Mary. The game is kill, fuck, marry. Any not more of my taste. Who's who? Do you find? Who are you looking at? Nana. Nana. Oh, Nana's not your thing. Nana is hot. I prefer I think cute. cute oh. I yeah, prefer yeah, someone uh, like Nora. Nora Danish. So, so Sajar is Sajar Tan, Tan, Just another notable Malaysian. Ah, uh, Sarima Ibrahima. I don't know who's how. <laughs> do you know Nora Danish? Who's that? I know, but I can't remember how she looks. Uh, Miss Puyi. <laughs> likes have someone respectable. Yeah. <laughs> Who else? Who else? One, one. Okay, la Indian, la Indian. Uh, Jacqueline Victor. Jacqueline Victor is Indian. Wait, are you serious? Jacqueline Victor, right? The singer, right? Yeah, is she? Yeah, Jacqueline is she Victor. Indian. I don't shout know. Out, shout out, shout out, Jacqueline Victor. Jacqueline Victor, yeah, la Indian, la. I don't know, dude. Ah, uh, Jacqueline Joshua Tanaraj Victor. Joshua. Yeah. Joshua. Just call Josh. Hey, Josh. <laughs> hey, Josh. Sub, Josh. Uh, uh, yeah, but I give my business card to Jacqueline Victor. What, in Bangsa, really? yeah, because Aro stopped by, yeah. and he was Aro. Aro was like, "Hey, look, it's Jack Victor. Do you want to give a card?" I was like, "Now?" He was like, "Yeah." Yeah. I said, "It's fucking cars behind waiting." So I got out my car quickly, ran to. I was like, "Hey, Jack, I'm a big fan of you. Mm. I've never listened to music, but here's my card." <laughs> and she took it. She took it. So so nice. Huh? There was oh, under Jack a minute. Did she reply? Know, Did she reply you? I. No, she didn't. I don't think so. Oh, it's it's normal, though, dude. No. She probably called, and then you didn't pick up. You didn't pick up because you got no line, also. What? No, back then I had line. Fuck, dude. You know why I did that, not because Aru opened his mouth. So I'm Jen. What? Jen Chia. Jen Jen is the one oh. with the short hair. Yeah, the very talkative, funny. Oh yeah, the, this is funny. Personality. Dude. Okay. Okay. Fine. Let's put. Okay. Her. So Sajat, Sajat, Jen, Jen lah. So I'm Jen. Eh, Jen Chia. Jen Chia. So I'm Jen lah. Okay. Kill Mary Fuck. Your turn. Uh, you go first, Ashraf. This is not the Muslim side, but yeah. Fox, go, go. Uh, kill Sajad. Fair enough. Why? Why would you kill such yeah, a beautiful Muslim lady? La. Oh, I know. I know. I'm. I'm Sharia, bro. I'm acting, dude. No, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> like, I couldn't believe you there. But continue. Are you serious? No, th- because it's the only choice. Beside, I don't have taste with her. You want to go heaven, nah? Yeah. No, he's straight. Oh, you're straight. Yeah. yeah straight. What the fuck? Then what are you doing That's here? That's what straight men do. They uh-huh. kill trans people. It's just a what? It's our culture, the bro. Fucking Ashraf is doing it right now. It's our culture, bro. Okay, yeah. so kill Sajad. Yeah. Kill Sajad is because it's the only choice. Yes. Uh, no offense, Sajad. Love you. Okay. Fuck the the last one. What's the name? Jen Chia. Jen, uh, Jen Chia. Yeah, Mary. Mary, Mary uh, Lizzy, bro. Ah, okay. Wait, what? Ka- which Lizzy is this? Ka- Lizzy. 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 I thought the no oh, Lizzy. I was thinking, I think about Lizzy. Lizzy is hard, by the way. Uh, 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 subjective lah. Uh, subjective. She's alright uh, lah. She's got a beautiful voice. Like not get cancelled. Like, like you know what he said lah. You know what he said. She's 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 got a be- beautiful voice lah. Yeah. <laughs> she's a nice person lah. So, ah, uh, I'm sure deep inside. Good girl, very good girl, very good girl lah. Couldn't product. be any better of a person. Uh, uh, you, you, so me. Yote, yote. Okay, so kill Jen. Because it sounds cool. Kill oh no Jen. no! I gotta know who Jen is before I will. Do yeah, you yeah. know? Yeah, just just search her, search her. Jen what? Auntie. Uh, Auntie ah, uh, I think she about the investment ah. Uh. What's what's the name? Auntie what ah? Uh? Uh, I mean, what's her character called? Aunt- Jen Chia. Jen Chia. So. I like what her did nose, I say? dude. I like her nose. You know, kill Jen, fuck Elizabeth Tan, marry Sajad. Progressive. No, mm, progressive. Sajad, <laughs> Sajad uh-huh. among the three, Sajad is the richest. Right? Uh-huh. Ah. So, so you're yeah. that type ah? Uh, you're gold digger. Why not, bro? So I'll just everybody. I'll just go dive up. Like, what's up, bro? How you doing? Yeah. 
That's it. Yeah, but bro. Just show la. affection. La. Just show affection, lah. Okay. Sing one two songs, get two three million, ciao, lah. You're the feature. I mean, you're opener for. Bro, such I'm doing music, bro. I need money. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, so yeah, Harish, have you seen enough? Yeah, Jen is cute. Okay, so say okay, so kill Mary Fuck, Elizabeth Tan, Jen, and Sajad. fucking Sajad. I'll kill Elizabeth Tan. Okay, fair enough. I oh, because why. you like cute, not pretty. <laughs> no, because just like I, I think he has plans with Sajad. That's why he has to kill one. Ah, okay, okay. okay. Next, uh, probably fuck Sajad. Nice. Yeah, why? Nice. Why? New uh, market. She's curiosity. Was she? Already ha- has she already transitioned fully to a female? Or? Yes, yes. Oh, yes, she has yes, yes, yes. She has oh. the camel toe and everything. But even if she hasn't, would that change your mind? Sword fight? Yeah, that would change your mind. I think I would marry Jen. Marry Jen. Yeah. Marry Jen. Yeah. Oh, what is this? <laughs> the lover boy. The lover boy. Yeah. Yeah. You like? Hey, what about you? Okay. Uh oh, shit. Let me think about this now. Cause two Chinese one Malay. I fucked Sajad. Okay. With, with love, fuck with love. With love. Ah, oh, sorry, not fuck. I make love to Sajad. Wow. Okay. Uh, I killed Jen. Elizabeth Tan. Wow. Seriously, you? Kill, kill yeah, and I marry Jen. How dare you? How dare you? It's the same as me. Is it? Yeah. Does that mean we are gay? <laughs> no comments, lah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's this, get it, guys. This podcast is gonna be the longest, most boring one, unless you like fucking dark jokes, lah. Okay, okay. The last, uh, this one is bad jokes that you all have. Okay, we do bad jokes after this. Uh, uh maybe you can use like a celebrity. Yeah, now. yeah, celebrity. Who celebrity, yeah. Uh. Okay, okay, Zizan Razak. Oh, oh Zizan Razak. Okay. Yeah, Kill fuck Maria, yeah, Zizan. Let's do comedians, lah. Let's, Let's put do a comedian also. But okay, so, uh, Zizan Razak, Jason Leong, this, yes, and uh, Kuma, Kuma from Singapore. Ah, uh, Kuma. Oh, that one, this can't work, lah. Malaysian, lah, Malaysian. Aren't you gonna kill Kuma? No. Why are you judging? Why are you judging? Oh shit! Sorry. Uh, ah. Uh, okay, marry Kuma. This is the thing. Remember, I, I, I said. Sorry, not, sorry, remember, I said all straight men want to kill trans people. Yeah. Yeah. It's not uh, me, yeah. It's me. It's, it's not <laughs> you, dude. It's happening everywhere <laughs> outside, dude. I don't want to. Okay. Seriously speaking, all straight males, huh? By the way, but yes. we are joking about killing Kuma, transgender person, fucking this, <laughs> fucking that. But it's all jokes, right? Hey, but, by now, they don't understand it's a joke, right? They just want to throw hate off. Yeah, of course, of course. But uh, what? Joe Flizo. <laughs> Joe Flizo. Okay, Joe Flizo. Can we kill, kill, kill? Uh? Just kill, kill, kill. <laughs> okay, Joe Flizo, uh, Zizan Razak. And Jason Leong. Jason uh. Leong. Zizan Razak, Jason Leong, Joe Flizo, uh-huh. Kill Bang Mary, go. Okay, okay, you start, Ashraf. Okay. Uh... <laughs> so fucking gay. Uh... So, who you want to kill and why is it Joe Flizo? <laughs> <laughs> kill Zizan. Kill Zizan? Uh. Who are you jealous of? Uh? Jealous, bro. I want, I want to act. Like fuck Jason. Mm-hmm. Fuck Jason. What? Money, fuck? dude. Money. Yeah, but you, you want the money, you marry lah. Yeah, fuck. I just need one time that reinvest that money. Reinvest that money. I got business brain, bro. Mama. <laughs> you fucking one time. How much money you think you get? Jason, ah. Uh? Yeah, give Netflix special lah. Uh. Oh, ask you to the door. Marry Joe Flizo. Yes. Fuck Jason. Kill Zizan. Kill Why you want marry Joe? Money, ah. Uh. <laughs> so money. <laughs> Both money. He want to open mama, bro. Oh, fuck. I thought it's for the passion. Bro, nothing is for the passion. This no, life. dude. It's for the money, lah. For the money, lah. That's passion. Joe's la. richer than Jason. That that's why I'm marrying him, lah. What but what if he's a shitty husband? But money, lah. Why if he's a shitty rapper? <laughs> you want him to die or you? What is this? You have a death wish or what? Dude, he comes for comedy shows, dude. Yo, I can't say that. Dude, no, but I've already said that. You can't say what. You can't say what. No, because remember, I'm trying to apply for the audition. Oh, sixteen <laughs> numbers, but. <laughs> Sorry, sorry. <laughs> he trying to apply for Nablus Bare. Yo, <laughs> I'm, I'm shit still gonna do it anyways because I like doing this shit. By the way, Joe Flizo, if you ever watch this, he's applying for the Nablus Bare, but he's gonna kill you first. No, no, no. Jokingly la, kill Mary Fuck. We're saying kill Mary Fuck. Oh Lord, have mercy la. Yeah. They're all chill people la. Dude. Nah la, Joe Flizo is Godfather la. How to kill him right? Cannot la. He's Snoop Dogg la, dude. But any hey, hey, your turn right? My turn. Okay, go. Okay, so uh, I'll, I'll, so I'll marry Joe Flizo. Because my music career will just yeah yeah. <laughs> yeah yeah I'll kill Jason Leong and I'll fuck Zizan Razala. Why? No, because I grew up in Malay, so I have a thing for Malay jokes. Oh, Zizan is funny. Hey, do you follow uh, Ryan Ryan Bakery? Yeah? Who's dude, Ryan Bakery? The guy's fucking. I've been following him since his first only three K, dude. Ryan Farm. I like to fucking brag this. Who's shit. Ryan Bakery, Ryan Bakery, Ryan Bakery. He's not 
Bakery, yeah. I messaged him. He's fucking funny, dude. The one that wears the powder on his face does like skits in school. Yes, sir. Uh. Ryan Farmy so, Bakery. But he's based in Johor, is it? What? Oh, right. no Farmy idea. Bakery, this one, uh. No idea. No, he's somewhere. Like, ah, yeah. All oh, this yeah. guy. Yeah, he's so hilarious. I love him. Dude. Okay. So, 723k followers. Wow. Remember the sh- the video you showed me last night? It's funny, dude. Ah, uh, Harish, so, medical fuck. I would kill Joe Flizzo. Why? I don't know the guy. <laughs> Oh, okay. so you know Zizan I know Zizan yeah, I've, oh, I've, I've watched I don't know him personally but I've watched his stuff on oh, YouTube okay, okay. Uh, marry Jason so that I don't have the fuck him ciao, ciao. Ciao, and I'll ciao. fuck uh, Zizan Salamat pagi you fuck Zizan yeah. why fuck Zizan Salamat pagi chegu inspiration inspiration okay you oh shit I'm probably gonna kill Joe Frizzo <laughs> wow yeah uh, kill Joe Frizzo because I wanna fuck probably gonna fuck no no I'm okay I'm probably gonna fuck you you sound like you wanna fuck everybody okay I'm gonna marry Jason Dong because he's funny okay okay no homo okay debatable but continue uh, Zizan I'd probably fuck him lah cause he's action star okay you know? Joe Frizzo I'm gonna kill you because fair I can still kill you and listen to your music lah <laughs> well he already put out enough music yeah, yeah. like he's contributed already oh, fair enough okay do you all listen to Too Fat last time yes of course what the fuck you know, it was like childhood and then my brother would be like playing Ana- Analayam and all the stuff also. Hey, do, yeah. you, do you know anyone that is doing Okta FX? Or? No. I know some Malays but I don't respect them. They broke? Uh? They... <laughs> no, because they only work for few minutes. Yeah, they only do it like for one, two times. Yeah. Then they make some money then I they think, stop doing I it. I think people who do Okta FX know what's their job? Watching the ad. Then they get commission. They right? get commission for watching the ad or sharing it with their friends. You know, uh, what the, they use what uh, Wak Do Yok and Fizo Omar. Have you heard of those? Oh, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Do you? Would you guys, if if Omi, you know Omi dating yeah, app, yeah. they approach you to <coughs> to make, uh, to promote their... 100%. Uh, 100% money, bro. Yeah, what the fuck? I'm not Malay though, you can't. They Omi uses you. influencers. Yeah. Like low level. So we don't qualify lah. We don't qualify. We are very low. I don't agree with this influencer bullshit. You are one, what? Right? Yeah. I am not an influencer, dude. Okay, agree to agree. Well, oh, you said that I'm with not, passion. Why, why am I influencer? Yeah, right. Don't be shy about it. Dude. Why am I influencer? Bro, you influenced me to come to your show, dude. That wasn't what I was doing. Well, I wasn't, hey, bad. Brian. That's not bad, though. What? I'm trying to influence you to get uh, Miss, what's her See, name? Miss Pui. Influen- Pui. See, you're still influencing. Uh, that's Shen, not me. Pui. But you're still influencing, what? They all left already. You know? God, <laughs> they all left already. They all left. They all left. All left. Honestly, you know? will come to your show. Dude. I'm Why encouraging not? you. Yeah. To what? So you're an encourager. Yeah. Encourager. Yeah. Do you know what's the other word for encourager? Don't Encourages. say that word. <laughs> what? What's the other word? <laughs> influencer. Yeah. Like, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, influencer is. Uh that yeah. Word. Everyone fucking hates that word, though. Yeah, I hate that word. Dude. Okay, like, bad jokes. Like if you are uh no, like a hot a hot girl that has a hundred k followers, are you influencing? No. Right. If you're a hot girl who has a hundred k followers and you put out makeup video every week then on how to are, do, yes, then, then you, you are, are directly and indirectly influencing. Yes. yes. But if you're a hot girl who's just posting pictures of this fucking top that you got in bundle, yeah. All you're doing is just influencing people to go to bundle and hopefully find the same top. Right. But that's also influencing fashion. Yeah, but the I guess the ratio, I guess like how many people are gonna go to bundle as opposed to how many people are gonna buy the makeup and use it. Yeah, that's that's yeah. the whole point. That's why yeah. they have so many followers. Yes. Let's like, say let's say they have hundred k. At least like two percent, two percent, one percent. Two hundred people. Are, let's say two hundred. Two hundred people are. is already business, dude. Yeah. So let's say an influencer with hundred k followers. She puts out a makeup video with um, a Malaysian brand. Let's say the Malaysian brand is uh, Lavi. Let's say the brand is Lavi, right? And they buy Lavi. This influencer buys the Lavi product and does a... No, L-O-V-Y. Let's say Lavi, okay? Uh, and they buy the makeup and then they start doing makeup and saying, Oh my God, this shade is beautiful. It's for dark skin girls. It's for fair skin girls. So they're not influencers. They're promoters. With- no, they, they are. They are promoting by not promoting. What they're doing is they are buying. Promoter will go like, bang, barang ni, okay, ni harga ni thing. They are Promoters just, are from the company. Yes. Influencers, Influencers are, are individuals. People, individuals, so. right? No, no. Yeah, wait, yeah so. but, but but what you're saying is true. So you are also promoting. Uh, but they have different labels. Yes, la. exactly. They, what promoter they is not do working are for the company. promoting. Yes. What they do are promote, yeah, is, is promoting. promoting. But they're not promoting like they're not customer doesn't come to them and go like buy this like no. They are using it, showing it and indirectly influencing people through the app or whatever, Insta or whatever to also try it. They're planting that idea. As a promoter, what you're doing is you're planting an idea to buy it. But an influencer, you're planting an idea of you using it and everything and 
it's like trial and trial thing for you so you're showing them exactly what you think and you're planting an idea in the head like maybe i i should try that also like kind of thing have so have you heard the more. heard the the saying where like in the 80s 90s all people were just going to jobs that already exist yes in now 2020 2010s are the years that people create jobs create jobs 10 years ago there was no such thing as social media manager 10 years ago startup was like a uh, high end beef like now it's like a proper thing. job yeah. social media manager is a proper job now any random person is like oh, i have a startup makeup Bro, company any, com- startup, startup any company any company su- influencer suddenly, is like that la it's yeah. a job that was created based on the technology that was growing yeah. Every, social media any, la social media yeah, yeah. any business any business they have to have a social media presence yeah social media is the biggest decider now yeah yeah so, so it's good that you explain that Because I've never, know. I've never gotten that explanation. Ah, okay. Yeah. Say thank you. Thank you, dude. Fuck you, bro. Thank you. Thank you. I say thank you, dude. Can we go into bad jokes? Sure. Oh, you. I don't have any bad jokes. Bad All my ones are great, dude. No, I just say that. I don't have any bad. Oh, I, I got. Uh, shit. No, no, no. Everybody has. Just he doesn't admit lah. <laughs> they're on the. They're on shelf. Go and coffee. Go coffee. Hey, you talk. Oh, I, I said this joke to to you before. Fuck. Let me think. Uh, hey, let me recall. Well. Let me recall. Hey, you tell Kenapa's uh uh orang Cina suka cakap CB CB untuk cibai. Okay. Kena Cina babi lah. Oh wow. wow! Nice. That's, that's proper bad, bro. Just proper bad. You have medal. It's funny, dude. It's, it's funny. It's a laugh, lah. It's supposed to be. No, it's the funny where you just go, oh my god. Really? Yeah. Uh. Hey, 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 you you tell it to uh pelawan UFC. Konek McGregor. Oh, Wait, did you write that? Uh, bro, I tell you, there was one time me and Ben, we were drinking, and then we suddenly thought about this joke, right? In the Uber, we kept telling the driver, like, oh, is this joke damn funny, right? This is damn funny. And the Uber driver said, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He just wants the 27 bucks, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah dude. He was a Malay guy. That's totally funnier than the totally joke. That's totally funny. You know which one is funny? I was like, yeah! yeah. Uh, luckily, 15 minutes later. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Kone yeah. McGregor. So the Kone one, did you write that? Is this no, joke? We just thought about it while we were drunk. So it was, you made that joke? La. It was your I, joke? I can't remember, bro. What about the CB one? That's CB, his, I just thought about it like recently. I don't know. Okay. Uh, right, so like, have you done it on stage? Right. What bad joke on stage that you've done? I've never done any, uh, any short jokes on stage. The jokes are always at least one minute for each. But so he is so new lah, so he can't tell which. Yeah. Is. Yeah. No, and also the jokes are not a few lines. It's always like the right. Sorry lah. Uh, so that CB joke, right? He actually he can actually do it on stage, but provided you kill for the first. Yeah, five no, no, minutes, I, I know you're right. That one, you, if you structure it properly, because people can relate very easily. No, no, uh, like, not that bit. You have adding. to kill for five minutes, and then suddenly do that you do that. That do that fucking dumbass joke. People will laugh. Why? Uh? Why? Why do you? Because you've already established yeah. five minutes. You already broke. You already broke through the audience. You did comprehensive five minute shit, and then you throw on shock value shit like China Barbie. People are like, oh my god, this fucking yeah, do dumb yeah. shit also. Like. Yeah. But here's the thing. <laughs> you can also go wrong. Yeah. You can. Go, you can also you'll go bring wrong. your set. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. You also go wrong. <laughs> Kehar is you. Bad joke. He's a hamster. So wait, there is jokes <laughs> that bomb on stage. Just bad joke, Just bomb or not? Okay, yeah. joke that you think is the the lamest joke that you've heard and ah, it's, okay, it's okay, still okay. fucking yeah, funny. Uh, lamest joke, but you still find it funny. That's oh, okay, one. yeah, that's one lame joke. Yeah. When I wrote this joke, I was just. few months into comedy okay. so i can't really uh, can't figure remember. out the structure or how the joke flows but i just tell you the rough idea of it yeah so the joke was me uh getting a job to do data entry and i was like i say i'd rather because you know data entry there's boxes you gotta fill information mm. yeah people know what's that <laughs> yeah so i i'm like you know i'd rather fill in ice cube trays wait for two hours and have a cold drink mm. so that was the joke why do you continue comedy huh <laughs> 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 I really thought about that he before waited, he said waited, it. Waited, <laughs> he waited. Snappy. That's good timing. Very good timing. Just now you need the jokes, lah. So is that the the joke? The Philip ice cream. Yeah, yeah Philip ice cream. And then have a cold that, drink. Are you are you saying that that could work, but right? Did it work when you said it didn't work at all? B- and that was the only joke when I wrote. It's very very low magnitude though. Yeah. The punch the punchline is obvious, but it's very low. Yeah, but that was the only joke I wrote that I actually laughed. Usually I don't write it. I don't yeah, laugh at my jokes, but, right? But, but that was the only joke. Yeah, but what you think is Did funny doesn't. Did you laugh at it? Work. Sorry. I mean, what you think is funny doesn't translate to audience. Yeah, no, you can. It went funny yeah. to you. But exactly. Yeah. Was it funny because of the ice flip thing? The ridiculous thing. Because like, I rather do this. To me, the. You just think like a kid. The the punchline was having a cold drink. Right. Because me completely abandoning work. Uh huh. And I'm like, you know, I rather have a cold drink. Like a beer, <laughs> cold beer. Yeah, for you it's like just. 
Imagine this. So anyway, you have a job, 10 o'clock, but you're sitting out there having cold drinks. You're like, I'm done. It's like I'm putting information in the boxes, yep. but then I'd rather put in water in ice cube trays and then have a cold drink later. Yeah, because yeah, yes. you'd rather be doing that. La. Yeah. It's like, fuck this thing. La. Just no, get I, I, I get it. Dead but job. I'm trying to imagine if I'm not the audience, why mm. wouldn't I find it funny? Because Maybe because it's just not funny. It's Maybe, like, yeah. No, but, but, I can see, but I can I can see the clear, what do you call it? Uh, but, the relation but and looking, the contrast. Yeah, but looking back at it, the joke can work yeah. if I've built a narrative over talking about jobs and how fucked up it and is and then I and lean that. it I slide I slide that part I go into that part maybe because that you joke want me to find out or, yeah just want me to find out I gotta work it out lo. but that was a, it, is it gonna make a comeback um <laughs> I'll have to look into it definitely okay so uh who's next Ashraf me uh this is a joke I do I did last time that I I think is lame. Yeah, the lamest one you can think of. Yeah, right? so it's it's a true story actually. So wow. we're not drinking, my friend, mm-hmm. and then their house is too far. So I told just hang out my house until morning. Then we can have breakfast and chow. So then I came back home three o'clock. My mom was still outside, and she could tell we were drunk. And my mom is she's funnier than me. She's mad funny. So and she's serious funny, you know. So she's just like we are drunk and we can't even talk properly. And then she goes like, "You want to enter the house? Uh, okay, auntie, ask one question." Um, why did the goat cross the road? So we all like at this point we all like date ready, right? So the answer was um, because the goat wanted to go back home. Your your mom. My said mom said it. Three o'clock in the morning. She just went because the goat wanted to go back home. But do you think she found it? That's a good one. She said it and she just looked at us. And did anyone laugh or you all No, we all just froze like. like you couldn't process it or like we're fucking drunk, wasted, bro. You fucking come to me, go. How do you remember it though? Because I remember the joke. I wasn't the most drunk fella. The two fellas were. Okay, okay. Right? So it's like, we were like... Don't hang out with those people. Uh. No, no. It's like... <laughs> it's a story, dude. First, yeah, it's a story. First of all, it's two fellas first time coming to the, inside the house. First time meeting my mom. And then first time meeting and then like... The whole thing was like, mom was like drinking. Ah, I beat auntie. And then my mom was like, I want to go inside. Ah. A beat is always a beat, right? Yeah. <laughs> so then my mom was like, yeah, auntie asked a question. Why the goat wanted to cross... Oh, why did the goat cross the road? And then at that point, all three of us, like... We know we had to answer because mom's asking. So, and then, we didn't say a word, but through our eye communication, we were like, hey, fucker, your mom is, like, they can see in their face, like, your mom is fucking psycho, you need fucking, and I was like, Puna, you want to come to my house, right? You answer, like, I know, but nothing, no conversation was going on, it was just eyes, you know. Yeah. And then, one of us had the brain, like, the brain power to go, like, auntie, you tell auntie. And then my mom just go, auntie, tell, huh? uh, because the goat wanted to go back home. Do you think and then she... we just, we just waited there for like three, three to four seconds. Okay, and did we go inside, huh? <laughs> so we just laugh. You all even give her a, a laugh or chuckle? No, they chuckled, laugh, but then it was like, because uh, <laughs> <laughs> we were like, what the fuck, right? Your mom was doing a vibe check, dude. Yeah, mom was yeah, saying. My, mom, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mom was but when I woke up in the morning, I just went to mom's like, mom, why the question yesterday? It's like, why cannot? She said, "Why cannot?" No, she's like, "Why cannot?" I just want to talk to your friends, lah. And then and she she's dope, talk to bro. them, lah. Like, what? Like, talk means like how you know, like, "Hi, what are you all doing? You all drunk? Ah, okay, come lah. Where you all went? That's talking, right? Yeah. But it's like more like oh, yeah, yeah, it's not, yeah, yeah. So my mom was like, "Vibe check, motherfucker! Why did the goat cross the road?" Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> do you think your mom create, uh, thought about it herself, or she saw it somewhere? Dude, my mom is psycho. She will come up with it on the spot. Yeah. Mom so loves com- improv, bro. Yeah, mom, mom, improv is my mom, bro. Like, that's mom. that level. Are, are you like that? Are he's you he's 100% like that. No, something, like, I, we learn from my mom. But then so. again, right, it's like he talks so much and so fast that it, it's, it's bound to come out. Yes, it's bound to come out. Like, uh, quality, uh, quantity first. You, Ashraf, are you like, uh, like you just sunny out of nowhere? Oh, you got an idea. And then you... Like, yeah, was, uh, spontaneous thoughts are one thing, but uh, I need I need to have like a reference point. So that's why I, I prefer like so for me my like improv that. is more to like crowd work. So I need to know a topic yeah. so I can play around. Hey, remember they very um, limited. They said like open micers can't do shouldn't do crowd Talk work. Ah work. okay that yeah yeah. But hosts of course you can do crowd work. Yeah, hosts of course you can do that. But did you do crowd work when you were doing open mics? Uh, when I when I get a spot, I never do crowd work. Because of respect. Or- no, no, not that. It's just that my stand up material yep. is not crowd work based. Yeah, no. It's all me just telling people. No, but even if you could, you would be like. I mean, like I shouldn't. I should do that. Uh, like, like only the very few don't. things. Like I interact with the How crowd. How you doing? All good. Uh, like, like I have a joke where I say I have a gay friend. Uh, he just came out as gay, and I say, uh, "Guys, clap like it's not easy in Malaysia." And then they'll clap. Uh, after they uh, right after they clap, I'll say like, "So we tied him up to a tree and beat the shit out." <laughs> uh, 
so so it's like it's like a int- it's like to trick them la does that work all the time uh, uh, as many of the times i did it, it because it's like, like a bro immediate switch in fucking, energy right? like for me is that's just a immediate switch in energy hit, you know? yeah but who are the people that you won't hit the people in the closet gay yeah, people like right. Gays like, oh my god, that's a joke. How dare you tell jokes about Buddha instead? Hey, gay people can are funny too, man. They're often funny. Dude, actually. people are funny. People are funny. What is this fucking narrative? Gay people are funny. Uh, uh, lesbians uh, uh, are funny. Yeah, sorry, like, sorry. No, no, I understand, but uh, people are funny. You know the chick, the girl cross the road thing. Huh? Hey, was that's that your uh, bad joke? No, 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 no my bad joke. Right? That's a good joke. So there was this small girl who told me this joke. She asked, uh, "Why did the ghost cross the road?" Ghost. Oh, ghost. fucking! I don't oh. understand the joke, but continue. Uh, yeah. And you're still yeah. doing comedy. Like, Yeah, also. Da, 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 da. So she's um she's the it wasn't really a, like a joke joke but it got me thinking. The ghost cross road because uh to join the group of c- clowns on the other side. So there were clowns on the other side of the road. Yeah, yeah. And the the ghost chose to join the group of clowns. Yeah. So in to me in no, the to me that's it. That's it. That's it. But it's a it's a more It's a deeper Whoa. type It's like of imagine dude uh, This just It oh. gives you a sense Where fuck The ghost was like Feeling lonely mm-hmm. And he wanted to join A group of clowns oh, Because no, no, it no. felt like You mm. know what I could I could gel with this kind of guys Oh is it a reference To the Eat movie No, no She just not, she, she What is just, she five f- Four Four bro She's, she's four. four Oh, oh a girl A little girl a to you I forgot girl. that part Yeah yeah, yeah. She oh, possessed dude Yeah that, that, that one you have to Kind of You know what she does Besides it's telling the joke right? yeah. Watch Wonder Pets bro Of course she's gonna come up With shit like you that You know her huh? You know her So she's four bro Not Upin and Upin You know all four years old Four bro so I'm very close to them She knows his demographic Sometimes I'm very close to them Okay Ashraf Tell your bad joke Okay my bad joke Is actually like My attempt On dark jokes lah So okay. uh so it was me so I I'm from Klang right yeah. so I was driving in Klang and I saw this guy like really like tough big guy okay. scar on his face like yourself, uh, uh, like yeah that's, that's I, when I scar. saw him I thought like am I looking at a mirror uh-huh. and okay. then like he's there right so when I saw him like he was doing like the most wholesome thing ever you know he was He looked tough and like yeah. he wanted to kill someone but he was plucking flowers. Okay. He was plucking flowers and it's so nice. It's so nice to see someone, you know, taking responsibility for their victim's funeral. Oh, oh okay. So he murdered the person when pluck flowers to put What in flowers there. What flowers he pluck? Oh, okay. Jasmine okay. flowers. Hey, Malika pula. Malika pula. She gave him Malika. So he gave him Malika. Okay, so now I understand when you were saying like how So it's I did that on stage bombed like fuck. Of course. That was a great people, joke. Dude, that was a good joke. Yeah. Stared at you. Like what the fuck? No, you'd be like what the fuck like yeah, That's yeah, my yeah. attempt on dark. But that's a good joke, not a lame joke. Yeah. That was a good joke that bombed. Oh. Why? Because it wasn't coming to the, the, to the right audience. audience. Bro, you maybe. think it's good because it's exactly down your alley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, yeah exactly. It's exactly down your alley. Some people will be like, "Oh my god, it's a riff." But the only thing that that The only thing, like the only way to it's, define if it's good is whether people laugh or. Right? Oh my god, no! Dude. No, okay, wait, see. No, 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 no. no, no, no. When you say down my alley, down my alley, yeah, that's that's a fair point. But structure wise, yeah. it's good. That's a good joke. Whether can, yeah, it's my style or not my style, like yeah. the like the jokes Gajin do that fucking hate. Yeah. But structurally, yeah. I'm like, yeah, fuck. Oh, structure works. Yeah. 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 Sorry, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking love. No, but he's right also. He's right also. Yeah. Now he can do the joke to a room of twenty people who love dark jokes, who understand it and laugh. Or he could do it in a room of twenty people who love slapstick comedy and just go, "What the fuck is that?" So, so his audience as well. Do you think it was the audience, or it was just that joke was just? Uh, it fast, was. Ju- I think it was the first time I was doing it. Yeah, so yeah. I also was like, "Shiver!" It was my first time doing like a fifteen-minute set. Malika, yo, okay. So I got a dumbass lame joke. Mm. Uh. It's stupid. Okay, so yeah, I was driving in Bangsa. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I was driving. And then I kept okay. driving. Yeah. Then I kept on driving, and then I went back home because mm-hmm. I couldn't find parking. <laughs> oh, okay, I remember this joke. Yeah, yeah. That was my this most that joke. Oh, joke. you actually said it on stage. Yeah, before. that joke is funny because of that leading thing that people But go. I, I wouldn't so be surprised. Driving? So you're driving. So you're driving. So you're driving. Then I went back home. So you didn't park, lah. Like I wouldn't yeah. be surprised if there's one or two laugh. Right. No, actually, people laugh. People, people giggle. That yeah, joke laugh. worked, but yeah. I thought. Yeah. And I also purposely put it at the end because I know it's not gonna work when you start off with the joke because the fucking yeah. dumb that joke right you need more strength so you're gonna be like guys I was driving I was driving 
was driving and i just went back home la that kind of thing so it's like uh kind of like downletting moment in your life kind of thing this thing is like it's so it's so interesting how you always we always try to understand how the joke works or how how it's going to hit or why it didn't hit but you really can't explain it because everyone thinks so differently it, yeah but as a, on your personal level yeah. you need to do that because if something goes wrong then you have to be like okay i can't go to 10 people and ask yeah. i don't have 10 people in front of me right now what is the best thing i can do yeah But Why do you think it didn't hit? You think lah. Yeah. But or uh, like the gay one, the gay one that he said, right? That one just hits me because it's it's my, such a turn. It's my uh, not only the turn, also the reality. I just love gay shit. Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Yeah. And yeah. and and you can't put the blame all the time on the audience or so. Yeah. Fair like enough. some shit, yeah, some yeah, some yeah, things. Right. Yeah, yeah that, can, that's one mentality yeah, you should yeah, have yeah. to improve yourself. Improve yourself. But uh, what it, the, it's like just the mentality yeah. thing. Yeah. So like but, but what you the can just fucking ah, yeah, yeah. They, well, sometimes it is the audience it sometimes the audience. but then it's the mentality you should have that no I should improve yeah, because myself because demographic yeah. cultures ah. but not only that because there's only so much you can control ah. at the end of the day like a joke can be good but if, it, if a crowd doesn't laugh at it mm. that's okay yep you're not going to hit everyone and sometimes you're not going to get hit anyone is that okay though that is okay because the joke doesn't they la. don't find it funny yeah. so it's yeah. okay try la la you trying to see but how is it jokes. okay if you are the comedian trying to tell a joke because your goal is to make people laugh yes okay <laughs> that's why i'm part of it no no <coughs> see <coughs> what he's saying is true so no, no, no I, i'm not saying that during open mics or trying out new shit i understand i understand yeah. look like would you keep that in your special if uh, you were like, like, like that's it that's it improve on it yeah of course like definitely yeah like if it works if you improve on it or Because you were saying that no, because it's like this. At the end of the day, when you do certain jokes that don't bomb, yep, it's not your crowd. Okay. And slowly, the more you do it, you'll get your crowd, and you get the kind of people that actually get your jokes. Yep, yep. Basically, he's talking again, again about the same thing. What you said, what he's taking it. What, what? So you're a performer, right? When you're a performer, whether you're singing, dancing, acting, comedy, what the fuck, you're doing it yep. for a crowd. Yep. Mm. So at the end of the day, the ultimatum comes from the crowd right now what you're talking about is let's say there's 100 people in the crowd and 20 people like your shit then for the next show you will like if the 20 people were there because that's your crowd that's the people who understand your joke that's what you're trying to say right so as you go with comedy you will find more and more people who jive with your shit yeah so so it's one is aiming a big crowd one more is fucking finding your niche lah yeah but at the end of the day i think we all understand that no matter what you say what is said and done it's still the fact that you are performing to a crowd you are doing a performance if you going to say no i do it for myself then do it home la right yeah or, yeah. or didn't run a room la you still you still need the crowd so if you want to judge whether a joke will bomb or win the crowd you don't say the joke bomb because i feel like it bomb you say the joke bomb because 20 people didn't like the joke then again it's a crowd right so it's like a balance kind of thing la i think most comedians whenever like all the top top fucker comedians they'll un- they'll immediately look at top top fucker comedians top top, 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 top fucker comedians, comedians. they look at him dude top top fucking comedians the show name dude top top fucker top top fuckers la top top fuckers <laughs> top top fuckers la who's performing dude who's performing who's the top top fuckers la uh, yash arul kidding <laughs> Um so you look at the audience and go you know what okay out of the 100 people these 20 people like my jokes okay cool for the next shows let's try to get them there and then find more people that's at the end of the day sorry dude it's like music like if i drop my music now and out of 1000 people 700 don't like what am i going to do i'm going to look at the 300 people like that's where the fucking viewership uh, I thought, is I thought, you saying, I, i thought you were saying that you tell a joke right and then no one laughed at all mm-hmm. and you said that that's okay try la la did you do the joke once Yeah. Or is, it, has the joke been done like fifteen times? Like let's say you do it once, ah. Huh? Then it's your first time doing the joke. Eh, hey, sorry, sorry, not. Ah, I, I mean, I thought what you were saying is if you are, let's say you're doing a ten minute set, okay. And then uh, one minute of the joke it just didn't work. No one laughed. Okay, okay. And you said, would that, I throw away the joke? Yeah. Is that what you're questioning? Yeah. Would you? Would I throw away? Yeah. It's your first time, no. Like, For yeah. that audience, yeah, lah. If ah. I know, if I, if I'm reading okay. my audience before I do a gig, mm. I know what kind of people are coming. I got to like get the kind of jokes that. Okay. To the tailor that audience. To the audience, lah. Which, for my case, is yeah. not the most easiest thing to do because your jokes are very specific, ah. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Okay, shall we, guys? Okay, shall we cut it out? All right, guys. That's it for today's episode. Episode that. Dude, you have thirty-one episodes. Yeah, thirty-one. Why you want yeah. give a word, ah? Sponsor, sponsor. Bro. Give a word, ah. Go on, Brian. Uh, no, bro. No, man. I should be having what seventy by now or hundred. Half puy, lah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, eventually we'll like have. No, how yeah, you said what? you should be doing more episodes, right? Yeah, of But 
You're gonna you're gonna get there eventually. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I will. Motivational. Yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. You're gonna get there. But I mean, realistically, lah, ten episodes takes you like it should be only ten weeks. Plus, yeah, you're doing this alone, alone, right? Uh, yeah, slowly. Yeah, editing alone. Yeah. Everything. Don't yeah, everything. so it's gonna uh, consume more time. It's a Guys, lot of make time sure you guys watch. Let's get it and report it. Huh? Yeah. It's a lot. Of time. <laughs> it's a lot of, uh, <laughs> of like, time spending yes, on the screen as well, right? Uh, a lot. Okay. Yeah. So it's okay. Like, you tell me this afterwards, huh? <laughs> you suck my dick afterwards. Huh? He hates you, dude. Wow, yeah. dude. He thinks I'm really kissing his ass. That's true, right? No, like being sarcastic, right? No, no. He's actually giving you words of. That's the thing. I swear, I cannot. I cannot differentiate anything this uh, Harish is saying. I think that's because you're gay, lah, bro. That's sad, actually. Why? She's gay or something. No, actually, in a way, in a way, it offends. I it, I feel offended. Uh, I see. I can't even tell whether you're offended no, 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 or not. No, no, no. At this point, you know what you must do. No, at this point, you know what you do. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hey, watching, at this, Jackass. At this point, now, why is there anyone even watching? I don't what think so. If someone made it to two hours, bro, you need a medal. Yeah. Bro. Okay, hey guys. If you guys made it until the end and Thank enjoyed you. this episode with Harish, Murti. Tash. Sorry, stage name. Okay, now he's big time. Murti. Murti. And Ashraf, if you watch till the end, put a clown emoji down in the comments. If you love this episode and want to see them back on again or more comics, have more comics on, put a clown emoji with a splash, the the water droplet splash sign. Yes. If you want to watch all of us together, go and create a whole app and put it on Play Store. And you make make yes. new emojis. Make new emojis. Yeah, yeah make new emojis. And one last time. The lineup is taking place on the 26th of October. 20, 20, I knew that. Okay, 28th of October. End of this month. Go check it out. 20, 35 bucks for a ticket. And you're going to see two main acts. and uh, Musical uh, act. We've got musical. We've got Pash, sketch comedy. Morty. Yes, sketch comedy. It's basically a variety show. And also you get to see Jason Leong. Okay, oh, this month. 35, 35 bucks. bucks. If you go see Jason Leong special, how much is that? Just do the math. What? 34 bucks. 80 huh? bucks? 80 bucks, you know, that's one hour. He's going to perform 20 minutes on the lineup. It's better than investing in Octa FX, dude. If you do the math right, Jason Long, 20 minutes of good material is worth maybe 30 ringgit or what? That's already the whole, the, the price of the whole ticket. Yes. Yeah, and then you get two other comics and you see sketch shows. You should sell Unify, bro. Yeah, dude. The show is called The Lineup, right? So please go on Instagram, just look up The Lineup My, that's the handle. Um, This is Harish. He runs the fucking show. No, we yeah. run it together. Yeah. The three of us run it together. Me too, me too. We... I saw run her. Yeah. He runs away. Yeah. So, <laughs> so, my name is Murthy and I'm going to be singing on the show. This is Ashraf Kamal. He's going to be doing sketches on the show. So, please go check us out on Insta. The link to the tickets is on Insta itself. You can just go to the bio and check it out. And I hope to see you there. Okay, see you guys in the next episode. Let's get it. Let's get it. No point in trying to ask again and yeah. over again. Well, okay. let me try one more time. Girl, won't you come on over, ride with me? I must have asked you one, two times or three. Not pressuring though, we can let it be. Oh, you got one over, ride with me, ride with me.